Hello everyone, this is ACS Yes here, back to some more Brood War playthrough action. We already beat the Protoss campaign, uh, and now it's saying, hey, you gotta finish the Terran campaign first, so let's go ahead and start the Terran campaign, the Iron Fist. Since the conflict began in the Caprulu sector, the ruling council of the United Earth Directorate has closely monitored its wayward Terran colonies. Having witnessed the steady advancement of the Zerg infestation and the maneuverings of the Protoss throughout the colonies, the ruling council has finally agreed to take control over the war-torn sector. Learning that new Zerg Overmind has infested itself upon the planet Char, the UED has sent its greatest admiral, Gerard Dugal, to capture the creature. As captain of the UED fleet under Dugal, your objective will be to storm the Terran Dominion and dispose, or depose, of its dictator, Emperor Minx I. First strike, UED flagship Alexander, high orbit over the planet Braxis, outlying Dominion stronghold. Adjutant online. Good morning, Captain. Our long voyage from Earth is over, and we are holding a stationary position near the borders of Dominion space. I trust that the effects from your long, cold sleep have worn off by now. If not, the Med Officer can provide you with additional cryostim supplements. Admiral Dugal has issued a proclamation to the entire fleet via Transmat. I'll patch it through to you now. Attention, defenders of the United Earth Director. This is Admiral de Gaulle. You were all briefed before we left Earth, so you know that we have come here to conquer this sector in the name of humanity. Should any of you have second thoughts about performing your assigned duties, be reminded that if we fail in our mission here, not one of us will be going home. We stand or fall together in this forsaken wasteland. Serve the Directorate. Serve humanity. All other priorities are secondary to victory. De Gaulle out. Transmat completed. Receiving incoming transmission. Good morning, Captain. I am Vice Admiral Stukov, tactical advisor to Admiral Dugan. I see you've already reviewed his proclamation. I'm sure it doesn't cover anything you weren't already familiar with. Once you get to know the Admiral, I'm sure you'll find that he's actually quite personable. At any rate, Captain, I do have orders for you. As we are about to begin our invasion of the Dominion, we will need access to their primary data net and weapons diagnostics. To this end, you are to assault the outlying planet of Braxis and take control of its capital city of Boralis. You are to deploy your forces within two standard hours. The Admiral expects perfect results, Captain. Stukov out. Now, can we define perfect results? Because I'm not I'm not very good at that kind of uh, at that kind of basically play play style. I mean that's definitely not me, but uh, let's see what we got. What? No gas? Who the hell? Who the hell starts a campaign with no gas? All right, let's go. Let's go look for some gas. I see a ramp over here. Uh, we're just gonna scout around. Um, one thing I want to talk about, guys, is remember in in Brood War they had no setting to change your volume uh, as far as dialogue is concerned. So if some of the missions have really quiet dialogue, it's because I have to re-render the video. Um, I have to edit the volume up in specific places and. Sometimes Sony Vegas just does not want to cooperate and will not render these videos correctly. Um, I do have the most up-to-date and legit versions of Sony Vegas. Sometimes it still doesn't work, so it kind of is what it is, and I do apologize, but, you know, this game's like a decade old, so there's not there's not a lot of settings that you can really change in there, only the master volume. And, uh, yeah, so that is that. So I do apologize if the in-game dialogue is a little bit low. I have tried to fix it in a, a couple of ways, but... Anyways, just wanted to kind of clarify what was going on there, and I guess he's right about no gas, so I guess we're just going to go ahead and start, uh, hey, drop off your money, drop your money there, go ahead and build a supply depot there, and maybe get some vultures too, because vultures are pretty awesome! Alright, any gas over here? As, uh, does anyone have any gas that they want to give me? Okay, I do see a fire bat, but... Not enough minerals. I should probably build another supply depot, huh? Where you at? There you at. There's my, there's my lazy guy. And you're gonna go up there. 
Yes, getting some extra guys, Marines, Vultures. Yeah, yeah, I just finished the depot. And another depot. All right, I think we're, I think we're gonna be good. I'll wait for one more Marine before I move out. Making sure my economy is on good track. All right, there we go. And the Vulture should be done pretty soon, so let's rally him over here. Ah, the one Marine, take him out! Take him out, no, don't die! I think that was my first casualty, or first two casualties. Whatever. Whatever, where's that Vulture at? There he is. All right, who needs Marines anyways? No one makes Marines a TBT. At least in StarCraft 1. <laughs> All right, so, my voice is still a little uh, a little asleep, but I woke up this morning, I jumped out of bed, and I was like, I need to play more StarCraft. So that's exactly what I'm going to be doing here, and come on, Siege Tank, get back there. You can do it. You can do it. I know you can. And let's uh, let's get into a good position here. Up, oh, up, oh, careful with the, uh, the vulture there. Marines are sacrificial, but the vultures I want to keep because I can use the spider mines later. All right, more SCVs all day. And uh oh, uh oh, they're dropping. No, not my vulture. It's all up to the siege tanks. All right, so far so good. So far so good on those. Uh, we're just gonna hold position on these though. No, my vulture. How dare you? All right, you go up there. Oh, we're, gonna, we're just going to go ahead and leave that. These Marines are not doing very well. So, maybe just build more depots when I can make actual guys. No, not my siege tank. Not my siege tank. Get out of there. Get out of there. I need you. I need you so badly. All right. There we go. Let's, uh, let's just let that burn down for now. Okay, as long as he's not killing my siege tank. Right, we're going we're gonna to go ahead and retreat for now. We're going to keep making SCVs. Vultures have proven to be kind of helpful. You know, I kill a stupid vulture. No, that vulture killed her. Are you serious? All right, it's time to go. It is time to go. You guys need to come over here and repair this. Oh, I can't repair it because I don't have any gas. No. All right, here we go. Here we go. And oh, yeah. Come on, kill it off. There we go. All right, we at least killed that. So we're, we're good. We see more vultures. I think vultures are the way to go. We got quite a few of them over here. I can repair a vulture, but I can't repair siege tanks because they take they take the Vespine gas. Uh, what are you doing up here, buddy? All right, everyone, calm down. We're fine. Okay, I did lose the one siege tank. This guy's almost dead too. He's only got 18 HP. That's no good. That's no good. Oh god, don't kill my tank. All right, you know what? No, no, they killed everything. They killed a vulture and almost my siege tank. All right, more vultures, more marines. I still want to build another barracks, but I think I might have to. All right, so you put that there. We gotta go ahead and build a depot. Uh, right here. No, my bad rally point. I gotta set that up here. All right, screw it. Let's go. Let's do this. I think the uh, the barracks should be taken out, if I recall correctly. All right, more marines. We do have a supply depot on the way. Man, they do, they have a lot of guys up here now. All right, don't worry, I can replace the dead very quickly. Vulture, Marines. All right, we at least took out this. No, not the tank. Anything but the tank. All right, I guess kill this depot, because why not? All right, more Marines. Going good there. You should probably build another depot. All right, well, hopefully now that I've killed this off, they'll stop attacking this location. Sheesh, man. Vulture is pretty good versus uh, Marines, that's for sure. All right, we still need some gas. I haven't been able to find any, so if anyone if anyone spots any gas. What? What? Nope, nope. Turn around. Turn around. You guys have got to be over here, I guess. And we're going to keep searching with this squad. No! What's happening? Come on, kill it. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, we've only got these units. And we got we better find some gas soon. Oh, what is this? Who is I am Lieutenant Samir Duran of the Confederate Resistance Forces. I've been monitoring your attack against the Dominion, and I'd like to offer you my services and skills in return for amnesty. Intrigue. Lieutenant, you have absolutely no idea as to who we are or what we have come here to do. Why do you wish to side with us? Because my men and I have sworn to fight against the Dominion and its Emperor. Seeing as how your forces have been laying into this Dominion base, I figured we were on the same side. I see. 
How exactly do you propose to be of service to us, Lieutenant? Well, I possess intimate knowledge of the surrounding area. I can show you an alternate route that leads to the rear of the main Dominion base. Very well, Lieutenant. Consider yourself and your men the first colonial conscripts of the United Earth Directorate. Captain, see that the Lieutenant is given our full cooperation. We shall see if he's worthy of Alright, well hey, he's got Vespian gas, so I'm, uh, I'm all for this guy. And let's see. Let's mix in these guys. They have shown us a new alternate route. All right, these guys, you're just, you you have a long trek ahead of you, so good luck. You are absolutely going to need it. All right, so we got those guys going. We have another barracks up here. And hopefully these SCVs can make it. I'm counting on you. And I guess we'll just keep making supply depots. Just kind of tuck them away back here. And you are gonna get gas, you're gonna get gas. I wonder if I should build another command center up there. Hmm. Yes, Screw it, let's do it. Let's do it, mo money, mo units. There's a base uh, up there, but obviously not gonna be securing that one anytime soon. All right, so this is control group number one. I gotta be so careful with him. If he gets hit by a mine or something, that is just going to be, that's gonna be pretty devastating. All right, there's control group number two. And let's get that. I definitely need siege mode, I feel like. Come on, Siege Mode. Come on, Siege Mode. There we go. Alright, take him out. Take him out. No, kill us. No, get out of there. Alright, so that was... Let's put one more guy in here just to be absolutely sure that we're getting maximum. Alright, there's Control 1. And I gotta start getting some tanks, man. Tanks, tanks are the secret. They do have those. You can also attack directly in the front if you would want, but I don't know if anyone would want that. I wonder if I can add, can you produce off of two factories? Uh, two siege tanks off of one base? I don't remember, let's find out. All right, homie, you're gonna stay back here. I do not trust you. I do not trust you one bit to stay alive. Ah, we got siege tank mode done, and more tanks. All right, there's control three. Basically, I'm trusting that you guys are gonna be able to march through the center of the map. All right, you guys come up here. Oh, someone got intercepted. Oh my God, is there someone on the high ground over here? Hang on, hang on, you guys go investigate. We got reports of someone on the high ground. Who's up here? There's totally something up there. I guess we killed it or it's gone. Either way. Either way. Let's just make a bunch of Marines. Screw it. I wanted to uh, not do that, but we're going to. Uh, I think you guys got stuck over here, didn't you? At least one of you did. All right, so there's that. And we can produce off of this one. And we're going to be having the add-on. Oops. Well, whatever. And, yeah, let's just, uh, let's just get quite the army going. All right, so let's fill up these hockey groups. You control two. You control three. What do you want? Oh my God, we're gonna have so many units. We are gonna have a lot of units. This macro is rolling like crazy. And we can indeed produce two tanks at a time. So I'm kind of excited about that. Okay, you guys go over there. More tanks. We're gonna get. We're gonna get so many tanks. It's going to be awesome. More marines. All right, you guys are control group number four. Oh my God, we have so many guys. All right, one, two, three, four. More tanks on the way. More Marines. Oh, oh, back it up. Maybe that was a little too far. All right, we'll just, we'll just kind of hang out here. There we go. Nope, nope, Vulture, you behave. You guys need to all behave now. Did these guys, where did my tanks go? What are you doing? Yeah, you gotta come up here. There you go. All right, let's uh, let's slowly start marching our way up here, just to see what we got. I definitely am low on Vespine gas. That's uh, that is a fact. You go there. You go there. All right, here we go. 
Good luck, everybody. Hopefully they don't have siege tanks up here. They do have some units up there. Maybe I should go up here just to kill us off, just for fun. Just for fun. Hey, what are you doing, siege tank? All right, maybe you should uh, come up here. And more tanks down here, yes. Oh, mess that up. More Marines, build barracks. Build their barracks. Where's my supply depot guy? There you are. You guys can kill this guy. You build some more of that. More Marines. Oh my god, what are you guys doing? You are a bunch of ants. You are a bunch of stupid ants. That's all you are. Whatever. We're gonna we're gonna set up some siege tanks here. Oh, uh, there we go. This is actually a pretty good place to set up siege. All right, there's that, and more tanks. You guys are going up there? More marines? You guys are going up here? Just uh, just keep making me some marines. Make some more tanks. All right, you guys caught that SCV? Yes, you did. Homie was a traitor because he was too stupid. More depots. All right, I think we're in. Uh, I think we're in a pretty good spot. We just gotta watch out for tanks. All right, did you guys take this out yet? There we go. You have to kill those off. All right, here's more reinforcements. More siege tanks on the way, baby. Siege tanks are pretty darn good. All right, you guys are coming up here. You guys can slowly scout up a little bit. We gotta, we gotta play this TVT style, man. We gotta leapfrog these siege tanks. All right, here we go. Here we go. Yep, you're coming over here. Where are you guys going? Come on, come back over here. More Marines, 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 Marines. You know what? Let's, uh, you guys are just going to straight on attack pretty soon, just for fun. Just for funsies. But for now, I think all you guys can go normal mode. What is the hotkey for that, actually? I guess it is O as well. All right, you guys going over here. This is actually quite an epic first uh, first mission, if I do say so myself. Uh, we got to get back this way. And you're going to siege up there. You go there. What are you doing, Tank? Come on. You're making it hard to click on you. All right, more Marines. More Tanks. All right, all you guys just attack the front. We're going we're gonna to have some fun with this. Because we're here to have fun, not play the game most efficiently as possible. At least that's why I'm here. I don't know why you guys are here. All right, you guys are going to come down here as well. Are they actually going to take out one of my tanks? That's not cool. Oh, there's no one in that bunker. Oh, oh, there is up here, though. They definitely have siege tanks. All right, Marines. Oh, my God! So many spider mines! Oh well, at uh, those spider mines, there were so many mines that the mines blew each other up. Which is kind of awesome. Alright, there you go. You guys have got this. I'm making more reinforcements, don't you worry. Don't worry about a thing, you, you guys have got this. I feel like maybe these siege tanks... Oh, watch out for the mines. I can definitely see why they don't want you going this way though, that's, uh, that's for sure. Build uh, engineering bay. Kill it! No, kill it! Shoot it! Shoot it! Oh dear. Oh dear, this is not good. We have actually lost quite a bit of stuff. But hey, we're, it's all in the name of fun! It is all in the name of fun. Oh god, you guys need to not go up there though. Oh god, I hear mines. Oh, splash damage, careful. There we go, killing some of their production. Very nice, very nice. Killing some of their depots. I don't even think they can use. Oh, back up. Nope, nope. You gotta get splash damage. Oh no, my tank. Get out of there. Get out of there. All right, you're gonna build a turret. All right, we got our we got our own little base here. We're doing good. Let's send reinforcements to the guys who actually need reinforcements, though. So. All right, you guys, go ahead and attack back over here. You guys go in normal tank mode. 
you go on normal tank mode. Do it. Do it. Alright. Let's see. Can I just straight on assault this yet? What did they got? Let's see what they got. Any tanks over here? Yeah, there is one tank, but he's not in siege mode yet, so that's nice. Nice, we finally killed that guy off. You guys can do this! You can do it! Go, go, Marines! Alright, more Marines. More tanks, more Marines, more Marines. Marines all day. Alright, we're, we're just gonna send them into their death. But don't tell them that. Alright, we got the flank attack coming. I think this is all we have to do, right? Is kill the command center? Which means we should just send in everything! Send in the troops from all sides! Wait, don't kill it yet. I want to see how much damage we can do. Nobody lives forever! Especially StarCraft units that are on my team. Alright, here we go. This is an all-on attack. Attacking from all sides. Attacking from all sides. They're still trying to produce, but they got nothing. They got nothing, baby. Uh, we we uh we kind of beefed our way through, so I don't know that we need this Duran guy. So that's uh, that's a thing. Are they? Are they though? I feel like their forces are under attack. We gotta we gotta build a manor manor turret. Yeah. Oh, this feels pretty good. Oh, look at this engineering base that can fly overpowered. Totally overpowered. More Marines, la 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 la. Send in even more Marines. Oh my god, we have so many as well. 155 supply. Freaking awesome. Alright. Excellent, Lieutenant. This planet's primary defenses are now crippled. Our tag teams can now begin to decode the Dominion security data link. Alright, a big old victory for uh, Team Husky. Now, I, I think they said destroy the entire city, right? They didn't say take it over, because uh, all that's left is four supply depots, which I feel like is not enough for my army to live in. So, yeah, mission number one, a complete success-ish on, uh, on the Terran campaign. So, I hope you guys enjoy it, and of course, I'll see you in the next game, and I will see you guys next time! That was, that was smooth. So smooth. Hello everyone, this is HPS Guest here, back with some more Brood War campaign playthrough action. Thank you everyone who's been watching and thumbs upping the videos. Let's go ahead and pick up right where we left off, the Delirian Shipyards. Delirian, however you say that. Uh, UED flagship Alexander holding perimeter orbit over the Delirian Shipyards outlying Dominion Trade Center. Receiving incoming transmission. Captain. Vice Admiral Stukov has informed me of your flawless sortie upon Braxis. I must commend you for beginning our campaign with such a decisive victory. Our attack teams have decrypted the Dominion's data link and have gained access to Ming's most guarded files. However, our work is not yet complete. We have ascertained the location of the Dilarian Sheepyards. These shipyards, serving as a fueling and repair station for the Dominion, house a number of functional battle cruisers in Drydock. To assure that our domination of this sector remains uncontested, you are to assault the shipyards and liberate as many of these capital ships as possible. Gentlemen, I recommend that you launch this attack using the utmost caution. Dominion Command can typically reinforce its outlying bases within 16 standard hours. You should expect some sort of reprisal from Emperor Mengs shortly. Ah, uh, the turncoat. I suggest that you pay keen attention to rank when you address the Captain and myself, Lieutenant Duran. Is that understood? Of course, Admiral. <laughs> You're beginning to show your age, Gerard. Give the boy some credit. He just tipped us off to a preeminent attack. However useful he may prove to be, Alexei, 
He will always be a traitor in my eyes. And you know that I cannot abide a traitor. Only too well, Gerard. Captain, when you are ready, you may commence with the operation. Once you have commandeered the enemy's battle cruisers, be prepared to repel the Dominion reinforcements when they arrive. Oh, oh, I guess you decided not to disappear this time, but, uh, you, uh, you got something to tell me, sweetheart? You, uh, you look like you, uh, you want to tell me some. All right, let's go ahead and jump into this game. Once so this is a... Landed, Oops. You'll need to escort our pilots to the battle cruisers themselves. They will be able to commandeer the ships and turn them over to our control. All right, troops, listen up. Each squad will have a medic assigned to it to patch up the wounded. But that doesn't mean you can get careless. Stay frosty and get the job done. All right, we got some medics, baby. Medics are so freaking good. All right, so this is not a uh, a build mission. This is a steel battle cruisers mission. So we're gonna go ahead and put guy number one up there. There is a bunker on the high ground, two bunkers on the left side. So let's go ahead and go for those ones. Battle cruiser operational. Battle cruiser operational. All right, save all uh, save all my guys, cause medics are freaking good, man. God, medics are so good. So good! Oh, I bet all the Terran players out there miss medics. Although, let's be fair, battle cruisers are pretty good too. Or uh, not battle cruisers, excuse me, medivacs. Medivacs are pretty good. And I guess my, uh, my, there we go, medics are just kind of chill out over there. All right, you can go grab that battle cruiser. We're gonna march up this ramp. And yeah, this is a mission where you don't build stuff. You just go around, capture those battle cruisers. We'll see how well I do, how well I fare on this type of map. There we go, and I think we go ahead and do that. Do I have stim pack? Oh, I do. I don't know if I should even use this though. Ah, screw it. Screw it. What's uh, what's a few drugs here and there, right? Am I right? Oh no, no, don't lose my first brain. There we go. We should be a okay. All right, we got all three of these. 100% success rate so far. Uh, we'll see how long that actually lasts though, because that was uh, that was the easy mode warm up round. We'll see how hard mode. How hard mode gets here as we continue on. Battle cruiser operational. All right, so what do we got? We got three ghosts. We got three medics. I guess the medics can go down here. Sir, permission Ow. to blind that tank with an optical flare. Uh, well, I mean, I guess. Let's see. So optical flare is F. Let's see. Let's see if we can do this. We gotta make it up the ramp. All right, blind it. Oh my God, quite some range on that. Can I just say that? All right, let's go. Let's go ahead and send in the first ghost. Never know what hit him. Never know what hit him. All over it. He's uh, he's all over it, guys. And let's see, is there anything over here? Uh, I don't see anything yet. It still has me a little bit nervous. All I have is three ghosts. Unfortunately, I don't have any nukes either. So let's see. There's pr I would assume tanks on the high ground, maybe. You can't really see up there with this ground unit. I mean, that is my guess. Let's see, if I do, is it E? What, what is that? C. All right, we're gonna walk around with this guy. C, C exactly. Oh, there it is. No, he's gonna die. Cloak. Woo. All right, we know where he's at now. Uh, so you, buddy, actually, you can uh, you can come over here and have some medic, some medic happy fun times while these two guys. Out, out, lock it down. No, no, cloak, cloak. I made a huge mistake. All right, we're gonna try this. We're gonna try this even more safe. Okay, so there was one tank here, one tank there, and I think this guy could make it okay, but I'm gonna wait. I'm gonna wait for a little bit. All right, so you guys are going to decloak, and the next will then begin to heal him. Right? Why are you guys not healing this one? He needs a friend. There we go. All right, so now what I can do is more flares. Actually, I feel like I should just do the flares. What do you guys think? Let's try that. Let's see if we can actually do that. All right, split these guys up. Go for it. The siege tank should be in range now. Oh, no. What have you done? Flare. Yes. Victory. All right, you guys heal up really quick. I think it's safe for you to come up here now. Uh, let's find out if there's anything over here just to see. Oh, oh. He's, uh, he's trying to attack me even though he's blind. Even though he's blind, I wonder. Let's see if I can get this guy. Up. I think this guy will be just fine. You guys should definitely head up here, though. 
Yay, battle cruiser. All right, here we go. Let's see if I can do this. Can you sneak around. Come on. Come on. Nice. All right, we got that one. We got that one. And there is two more over here. So we are going to rely. Nope, nope, nope. Don't let it shoot you. Don't let it shoot you as much as it wants to. All right, so optical flare is F. I'm going to come over here. And right there. No. No survive. No, they killed one. All right, well, we double blinded it. Let's see if there's anything else left here. I think we got everything, though. All right, so you guys are going to come over here. Did someone page me? All right, we may we may have lost one Did sexy medic, but uh, we were. Oh, oh God! No, 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 no. Hey, nope. Just uh, just ignore the tank guys. What's up? That's all we care about. There we go. Looks battle like we're gonna be able to get battle cruiser operational. Battle cruiser operational. Sir, the silos are secured. We've got four nukes on standby, awaiting your orders. All right, so we have nukes now. How many nukes do we have, though? Ah, four. All right, it's trying to show us exactly where everything is at. We gotta let's let's maybe save here, just because you you guys know me. Nuclear launch detected. All right. So we gotta try and figure out exactly where to go with this army. We gotta try and spot from the high ground. Let's see what we got. I, I'm still a little nervous here. Oh, oh, back up, back up, back up, back up, back up. All right, so this is what we're going to do. You are going to lock down this. Nope, no, no, no. Lock down. All right, and then you are going to cloak. Oh, God. Oh, God. And you're going to nuke right here. Nope, nope. You're going to nuke from right there. Oh, God. What are you doing? What are you doing, you medics? Apparently a random marine or something went over there. All right, this should this should come down. Come on, bring the heat, bring the heat, and missiles away. Kaboom! Oh yeah! All right, so that's uh, oh no, was that the? Oh, whew. I thought I lost some of my pilots, man. I was gonna be so upset with myself. All right, so there's that. There's those two. I think we're good there. You should go ahead and decloak. Go ahead and get your energy going again. All right, I think we lost a ghost, but as long battle as we have one ghost, yeah, double battle cruisers, baby. Oh, back up, back up, back up, back up. All right, let's see what we got. Ow, no! All right, here, new rule. You, wait, you're gonna be the ghost I use. You, no, you're both full energy. All right, so you are gonna hide down here. We cannot afford to lose more ghosts like that. All right, so I think if I cloak, what I can actually do is, I think I can nuke it from like right here. All right, you're gonna hold position. Oh my god, don't! Well, we could sit here all day, or we could just, or we could just shoot a nuke. I feel like, I feel like that is the better option here. Uh, I can't use these. Oh, I could totally lift these off though. I wonder if it would kill them if I did that. We're gonna try after we do all the nukes. All right, so that should take out this little happy party down here, and kaboomo! Still a couple guys alive down here, but uh, we can just, we can just kill these, I guess, one at a time. <laughs> Maybe. Is that going to take too much time? Anyways, there is a nuke over here. Let's see. I think this is a nuke potential. Some sort of nuke potential happening right here. And let's see. Are you going to be fine? Yes, you are. All right. Nuke right on that. Yeah. All right. I think. Hey, what's that? I saw a red dot on the minimap. All right. Well, this uh, this mission's pretty fun. It's basically just drop a bunch of nukes. And you guys can come up here. I think you are finally safe to begin attacking over here. Yeah, boy. How could they even spot up here? That is, that is lies and slander. There we go. Nope, nope. Attack from the high ground to get the high ground advantage. There we go. Okay, you guys go over there. You know what? Let's just launch another nuke. You guys chill out over here. Get my pilots. All right, I think that's the uh, the last group of guys. So after this nuke lands, I'm going to try lifting off the command centers. I'm just kind of curious. Just just out of my own morbid curiosity. I'm just kind of curious to see if it kills them or not. And ooh, his micro was terrible. All right, so we'll take this one. Well, that guy's going there. Let's just see. All right, let's, uh, let's float him on over. 
See, yeah. let's uh, let's just go ahead and scout around, see what we can find. See if there's anything very very enticing Battle over here or not. Cruiser operational. And let's see. Okay, so we got that one, and the last one is going to be over here. I have a feeling that they didn't expect you to lift these off, but we'll see. They do, they do fly very slow. See how, th how slow things fly in Brood War, man? These things are going to take an hour to get anywhere, which I, sh I should probably just go ahead and advance on through, but at least at least I'm trying. Hey, I saw that battle cruiser spotted some battle cruisers over there. Oh, God. Oh, God. What's the, uh, what is it? It's R. Restoration. Restoration. There we go. That's what you get. All right, so what do we got? Uh, one step ahead of you, bros. One step ahead of you. All right, so let's uh, let's hold position for now. So we have units up here, and basically it's siege tanks all over the place. Let's see, let's see what these guys can do though. See if they can deal with something on their own. Proceeding. And I think, oh, oh, back it up, siege up. Oh no, oh no, come on, kill it. Oh, nice. Oh, we have plus two attack, plus three armor. Can you attack that bunker? Is that in range? Yes. All right, here we go. So this guy's gonna cloak. We are gonna come up here and lock down this bad boy. Just go ahead and just go ahead and kill that. You know, you can actually decloak and attack that. Oh, don't irradiate me. Whatever you do, do not irradiate me. All right, so that goes gonna take a while. So we'll go ahead and send those over. Now we've locked down that right side. But for now, I'm feeling a little bit, a little bit worried. Let's see, yep, there's a tank over there. All right, so you need to lock down that. Because lockdown's freaking good, man. And unfortunately, we kind of don't get the, we don't get the nukes anymore. So that's, that's very sad. I think I'm just going to use this to kill that. Although, that could... I wonder if I should lock it down. Will it die in time? Hopefully. Hopefully it does. Also, hopefully I don't lose these tanks. Just kind of hoping there's no tanks up here, which so far... There is not. Oh, oh, back it up, back it up. Nope, nope, we're going to boat up right here. Alright, so I'm not going to be able to kill that guy because he's already in siege mode. Alright, so you guys decloak to get your energy back. Oh dear, back up, back up, back up, back up. Leave me alone. All right, so we can go down here, over and around, and then there is gonna be that one guy on the ledge. I can't deal with this guy yet because he's out of range. So we're gonna go ahead and go this way without attack moving. Actually, don't no, kill it, kill it, kill it. Maybe I should just lock it down. This thing's annoying, man. All right, here we go, here we go. Watch my sweet micro. Yeah! That's what you get. All right, guys, stop getting shot in the face. Go down the stairs. Everyone down the stairs. Single file. Single file now. Okay, so that tank was right here. I see. I honestly don't even think I can. All right, hold. There we go. Is he on patrol? Because if so, we're just going to kill him off. One ghost shot at a time. All right, there we go. Watch out for the tank. Watch out for the tank. I think we can put these guys here. These guys, can you go there? Yeah! All right, a little, uh, little shooting practice here. So far, we've managed to get every single battle cruiser, so I'm pretty excited about that. And we do have this. So if you are going to be the cloak. Hopefully, there's no science vessel up here. We're about to find out. Lock that down. Go ahead and kill that. You and you can also come cloak and kill that. But you're locked down now, so I can just go ahead and siege up right here. You guys should probably... There you go. Alright, go ahead and help with that. You should probably move down, and you are going to decloak. Definitely think the siege tank is going to be able to deal with that bunker. So that one and that one are open. There we go. Take him out. Take him out. Nope. Kill him. Oh, watch out for the splash damage. All right, so what have we got over here? Any any siege tanks? Of course. Actually, let's just go ahead and uh, kill that. You go ahead and move out. How are you guys doing on energy? Still pretty low. We'll keep you guys keep you guys around for now. 
And eventually that tank will die. But for now, we can bring out the pilots. Yep. Hey there, I'm going. All right, well, the pilots sound awfully likable, man. That's all, that's all I'll say about that. And for now, let's go ahead and bring the siege tank over here. All of you guys can decloak to get your energy back. And you guys gonna go down there. The rest of you guys come up here. Siege tank. Right there, we need a ghost to spot. There it is, hold position. And we're gonna get this battle cruiser pretty soon. So you're going over there. The rest of you guys coming over here. All right, that's an easy takeout. And then I think there's only one siege tank left. Oh, that siege tank's gonna have fun. Oh, you missed! How could you do such a thing? Uh, I guess you're going up there. Did we grab that one already? What happened? There we go. Thankfully, the AI is pretty darn bad. All right, so now we're gonna come up here with these guys. And really, all that's left is this one tank, so... You guys are gonna cloak. Go kill it. You guys just hang out over here. That shouldn't take very long to kill. Unless this guy... Come on! Come on, buddy, over here. There you go. Gotta babysit my ghost. My special ops warriors have to be babysat. All right, so we're gonna grab that. Come down here and grab this. Hope I didn't forget anything. Go ahead and decloak these guys just in case there is something over here. Anything, anything? Wait, 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 is there anything hidden down here? This looks a little suspicious. Blizzard is known for hiding things. Doesn't look like there's anything hidden today, but definitely had to check just to see. Battle cruiser operational. Captain, we are tracking a large fleet of Dominion ships in your vicinity. Bring it, baby. Uh, this must be the reinforcements that Lieutenant Duran warned us about. Captain, prepare our newly acquired fleet to battle the intruders. Good day, Commander. All right, all right. I got quite the, quite the concave going on. reporting. Make it happen. Quiet the concave. All right, let's do this. Let's do it. Hey, where'd you come from? All right, they're probably gonna swing around this way. I'm a, okay. I think we're I think we're pretty good. No one's sticking too far out. There we go. We are being hailed by the Dominion flagship NORAD 3. Well now, I don't know which militia y'all are from, but I advise you to back down now. I'm General Edmund Duke of the Dominion Armada, and in the name of Emperor Mengsk, I order you to surrender your forces immediately and unconditionally. Ah, General Duke. I expected your forces to arrive sooner. You should know that we represent not one of your ragtag peasant militias, but the combined might of the United Earth Directorate. Earth Directorate? You mean to tell me you've come all the way out here from Earth? That is correct, General. We're here to take control over this sector and its occupants for the betterment of mankind. Over my dead body. I don't care where you're from, son. No one pushes around the Terran Dominion on my watch. All units, fire at will. Alrighty, here comes the epic battle cruiser battle. Although they they don't have nearly as many battle cruisers as we do. Let's be honest. I saw battle cruisers showing up, man. A little bit late to the party, but still it's fine. All right, here we go. Time for some Yamada. You gotta individually do it though, otherwise it otherwise it messes up. I don't even think all my battle cruisers are attacking, but either way, either way. Oh no, don't Yamada, no! Oh, we're gonna Yamada my own guy. Whatever, no one saw it. No one saw it, and we're all gonna be out of that one just to use up all the energy. Boo! All right, that's pretty one-sided, even with me yamada my own guy. But, uh, you know, you can't trust me with this many battle cruisers. All right! One of these shorter missions, although, no, that was still probably, that was still probably quite a bit. How long did that take? That, that felt really short, but that's just because it's so fun. Ah, 18 minutes. All right, hope you guys enjoy it. Let's go on to the next game, and, of course, I'll see you guys next time. Hello everyone, this is HDS Guest here, back with some more Brood War campaign playthrough action. I'm going to be picking up right where I left off, which is going to be after stealing a bunch of battle cruisers. Ruins of Tarsonis, UED flagship Alexander, low orbit over the planet Tarsonis, former capital world of the Terran Confederacy. Captain, the Dominion shipyards have been destroyed, and it seems that General Duke has withdrawn his forces from this quadrant. 
We have impressed most of the remaining Dilerian defense forces into the fleet and stand ready to move to the next phase of our invasion. We've just received word from our research team that they've uncovered some kind of hidden weapons relay upon the planet Tarsonas. They report that it's called a side disruptor and that its purpose is somehow connected with the Zerg. Admiral, during the Zerg invasion of these colonies, the Confederacy had manufactured a number of portable machines called side emitters, which had the uncanny ability to lure Zerg to their signals. It was rumored that they had created a specialized emitter that could disrupt the Zerg's communications, but Emperor Mengsk was never able to find it. It appears that this side disruptor is the machine he was looking for. I must humbly suggest to you, Admiral, that the disruptor be destroyed as quickly as possible. If it should fall into the hands of the Dominion, we could face some very serious problems. Uh, a prudent call, Lieutenant. I am inclined to agree. But Admiral, this device could ensure our victory over the Zerg. It is foolhardy to discard such an advantage. Surely, Vice Admiral, you don't doubt the tenacity of your own fleet. Your Directorate forces will devastate the Zerg without the need for such a device. Listen here, Lieutenant. I've had just about enough of your- This conversation is over, Alexei. Given the true nature of our mission to enslave the Overmind, we could hardly stand to have Manx control a device of this magnitude. This side disruptor must be destroyed in order to safeguard our mission. Anson, set your course for Tarsonis. Oh, it's getting awkward up in here. To be fair, I would love to have a side emitter of my own. Lieutenant Duran. Since you have shown such concern for this device's inherent danger, I charge you with finding the disruption and securing it. We will commence with its destruction once we've cleared the area. Alright, let's get those guys going. Of course, there's two stupids. You have to individually split them. And we got Duran up here. We probably should put him inside a bunker. Alright, soldier. Sensors are tracking Zerg signals in every direction. It appears that our intelligence was correct. Admiral, if we focus on destroying all of the hives in this area, we may be able to neutralize these Zerg without too much trouble. State the nature of your medical New mission emergency. objectives. Destroy Zerg hives to disable Zerg broods. Bring Duran to the site or after Zerg hives are destroyed. Oh my god, this is going to be a long mission. Hope you guys are ready. Hope you got your snuggies on. And thank God they gave me some gas. All right, there is another expansion down here. Not sure if we can get there just yet. I do see a ramp here, though. So that's a, that's a good sign. And we're just going to macro up here as much as we can. Get the gas going right away. I always recommend going for lots of gas. Hey! Hey, buddy! I'm trying to, trying to cast here, okay? Not cool. Not cool at all. And what is this? What is this? Oh, God, Zerglings. Oh god, Zerglings. Okay, we're fine. We're fine. This is just going to be one of those missions. One of those non-stop missions. Might as well continue to build supply depots. Also, I kind of want to see what's up here. See if there's anything I can do about it. To clear out towards that expansion. I don't, I don't want to anger too many broods. I just want to see if this way is secure. Which so far it looks like it is. So we're going to build a command center there pronto. Because I'm more of a I'm more of a macro guy, and yep, it does look safe. So there's that. I guess just keep making marines. We'll need a factory pretty soon, so we can cancel some of those. All right, you're going into gas. You're going into gas. Go ahead and do that, and let's see if we can do something here. See, I don't know if this is gonna piss them off beyond reason, or if this is actually going to work out in my favor. That is, that is what I'm curious about. So we are going to come up here. Come on. Come on, you guys. There you go. Hold position. Slowly work on some of those buildings. Got to put another guy in gas just to make sure. We get full gas income. And we are going to build a factory. Nope, do that. There's that. Are you guys doing okay? Oh, no. They're pissed. They're pissed. I knew it. I knew this was a bad idea. I knew this was a bad idea. All right, both medics need to uh, get involved. Uh, come on, medics. Come on, medics. Heal. Heal up. Heal up. Yes. 
All right, we actually killed like everything there. That was pretty awesome. All right, we're just killing that and this upgrade thing, and then we're going home. Then we are totally going home. All right, more Marines. I definitely want an engineering bay again. Uh, build engineering bay. I feel like upgrades are going to be vitally important. Factory is on the way. I might need an academy as well, so I guess you're not going to be building a command center anytime soon. All right, so I definitely want to do... Let's see, does it require the sci science facility? Oh, God. All right, we'll get the armor upgrade on the way. And I probably built this other engineering bay too soon, but whatever. Whatever, you're going to come down here and get back to work as well. Should I save up for the command center, or should I make more, more units? It's actually a tough choice. All right, we killed their upgrade. I wonder, can I actually attack this hive from here with a marine? I don't think I can. Nope, not today. All right, so we're gonna we're gonna go ahead and back up down here. Put you guys in there. Actually, let's lift this off. Put this over here. And I definitely am going to need tanks. So we're gonna go do that. You come down here, and yep, we're gonna save it for the command center now. Getting the second gas geyser will be amazing. All right, how about right there? Is that good? Good-ish. Good-ish, probably not the best spot, but close enough. All right, so they do have a parasite on this guy. If you're wondering why he's green, that means the computer can see what I'm doing, but let's be honest, they can see what I'm doing anyways. Get those going, now I need an academy. This has all the important marine upgrades. I wonder if they have lurkers yet. If they don't have lurkers, we should be okay. Oh god, what's happening? No! No! All right, I think I can get over there and save it in time, but that's kind of annoying. We should probably build a missile turret back here. Oh, if I lose this, I'm going to be so sad. I'm going to be so, so sad. Come on, you guys. No, where are you going? Get over here. Oh, God. Well, now I'm probably going to lose it. we got to keep an eye on it, though. We'll see. We shall see. More Marines. Come on. Come on. What am I doing? I should have sent an SCB. All right, Marine. I'm counting on you. Draw away the fire. Yes! Good work, man. Okay, I hope the bounce damage doesn't kill it. All right, we should be should be okay, albeit barely. All right, apparently I have lost. No, get back here, Overlord. Whatever. Not even cool. All right, we gotta work on tanks and siege mode. I wonder if I can actually build. Uh, I doubt that I can, but if I could build a battle cruiser, that would be pretty sweet. All right, I'm going to send another SCV over here, and this one is going to be building turrets. Actually, no, we're going to build a turret there. And get marine range. Basically, I'm just trying to dump this gas right now, because we got quite a bit of it. Getting a science facility would help with that, I think. Man, having Duran inside the bunker, that's pretty overpowered. He does so much damage. Okay, so we got that, dealt with that. And that's done. We're going to go ahead and lift this off. Go ahead and jump this right there. And another tank. Do I have an idle SCV anywhere? Okay, I gotta build a starboard. Man, it was so difficult back then to get uh, upgrades. Okay, so let's actually put this right there. Block that off. Very nice, very nice. Alright, you're gonna repair that just so later we don't run into uh, any problems. Alright, one more turret, and then I think we're gonna be okay here. You're gonna build that there. Nope, nope, come back. Come back. You can do it. You gotta babysit these units all day. Alright, so you're gonna come up here. You will protect this with siege mode. You are gonna protect this as well. Maybe another tank, perhaps. Uh let's start rallying these guys down here though. Alright, you guys come over here. All right, I guess I actually have too much gas for now, so we're gonna just mine some minerals. And yeah, no battle cruisers though, unfortunately. So I think what I want to do is build. Um, let's go ahead and go for this. Just, I guess put this here. Basically, I'm just trying to wall in as best I can. And medics are going to be proved to be very useful. All right, get lots of extra mining going on, and we should be okay. 
Uh, I definitely need more depots, so we're gonna build this over there. Alright, you guys should be okay to leave. Knock on wood. Okay, so let's get, I think, I think basically what I need to focus on is siege tanks. So if I could get another factory, that would be great. Here I come up here. Now I can start these upgrades. Oh, uh, please don't be a drop. Was that just a, what was it? What, what's under attack? Something's under attack. And we'll go ahead and build this over here now. All right, we're doing good on this expansion. Oh, oh, where are you guys going? I think, I think the tank can handle this just fine. All right, we're gonna get lots of those, but primarily tanks, which means I do need some armories going. And you are going to build an armory here, yes? There we go. All right, so we're gonna, we're gonna have crazy upgrades, and it's going to be awesome. Main problem is just space right now. So, I think though, since we secured this, we can just build up there. I think I could even build a third one at this point. Yeah, I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna do it. Hopefully I have enough money, but I think that I will. And yeah, this is looking, this is looking pretty good. Maybe, maybe get some of that going, some of this going. Hey, what did my medics ever do to you? Oh, well, that felt pretty good. That felt really good. All right, so as long as we're building tanks all day. You know what, you should, you should just help out this guy. He could definitely use some help. All right, you guys go here. We're gonna get that one and that one. And should I get a, at least, yeah, I'm gonna get one science vessel. Just for detection, and we need stim pack. Or how's the upgrades going? Alright, we're gonna start saving a lot more gas here. You go there, you're in there, and let's get one more just to make sure. Alright, let's uh, let's start seeing what they got. Nothing up there. And anything over here? No, I don't see any lurkers, that's nice. Oh, you got stuck because of the add-on. Oh dear. Um, let's see, how do I want to do this? How do I want to do this? I guess just kill the add-on. All right, well, no add-on for you. Because I forget they always spawn in the same location. It doesn't matter where the rally point's set. All right, so there's that. Let's go ahead and build a supply depot. You can build a supply depot as well as you. How much damage is being dealt? Ow, where are my medics? Where are my medics at? Actually, Goliath's are really good too. Goliath online. So let's go ahead and get Goliath range. Let's get mines. And I'm even gonna go for vulture speed. Yeah, I'm gonna go for that. So my gas income's good. We have all the upgrades. So that's kind of nice. And this guy's done, so you're gonna get back to work over there. Oh my god, so many upgrades! So much gas! All right, let's see. I think attacking this base first is the way to go. Yeah, it is definitely the way to go. All right, so we're gonna take all you. You guys control group number two. Let's work on some tanks. All right, there we go. Let's even get this medic up here. Okay, more SCVs. All right, so you're going there. Mode, mode. Should be able to just like kill us off right away. Okay, I don't think I actually need any more SCVs. Let's let's stop that for now. That's just some crazy talk going on. All right. Oh, hey, hey, save this tank. Don't let him kill it. Don't let him kill it. All right, your base is mine. Wow. Wow, they actually got that. All right, everyone stay a little bit closer together. It's not working out nearly as well as I'd hoped, but whatever. We're still doing good. 
Actually, cancel that tank, because I want to get this upgrade. The upgrades are vitally important, and I'm also going to build a command center up here. Okay, that should neutralize all of those. As I thought, this brood can't operate without its primary hive cluster. And let's uh, let's get some Goliaths. Goliaths are awesome. I think I actually need another factory. So you're gonna build a factory, right? Yeah, where's a good place for a factory? Uh, I guess right there. You know what? No, we're gonna build it up here. You are going to build more depots down here. You're gonna do that add-on. Get the extra energy for medics because it's pretty darn good. And we're gonna go ahead and clean this out. They they definitely want you to go back on this level. I mean, what else could you actually go? Uh, factory for you. You're all good and ready. I'm gonna build one more factory. These are going to be for the zip vultures. Alright, watch we'll you build. Hey, oh, you never built this. What happened? I totally told that guy to build that. Alright, so we got that taken care of. Alright, I think we are going to be in pretty good shape here, actually. I don't even think I need the upgrades for Marines anymore. So I don't think I'm going to spend that any on that. Science vessel just. Oh, God, they cost so much gas! Alright, another, another depot. And yeah, good job, Goliaths. You got this. Goliaths are so good. Oh my god, they're so fun. All right, command center is on the way. Let's let's just go ahead and build up a lot of vultures right now, just cause uh, just cause they're so good, and we have lots of money to spend. So might as well do that. I think this guy's trapped. Oh no, he's not. Build another depot there. This one's almost done, but we got to build one there. Come on, gather! Don't get trapped. Build one there. There. Yeah, vultures. All right, we can start lifting some of these up just to open this up a little bit. All right, so I think we're actually pretty good to secure this ASAP. So you guys just go ahead and start mining. That's going to be lifted off. All right, go ahead and land this over here. Let's just now let's get let's get some Goliaths. Everyone loves Goliaths. Come on, Goliath, there we go. Alright, this is this is gonna be pretty ridiculous here in just a second. What are you doing? What are you doing? Yep, nope, nope, time to go. Time to go. I don't even know how you got over there. But let's go ahead and build refinery. You can go over there, although we should probably build turrets. Alright, so we got hockey group number one. So you're coming over here. And hockey group number two is going to be all these fancy guys. One, two. Alright, all you guys are control three. Oh my god, we're going to have so much stuff. All you guys are control four. There we go. Tanks. Tanks. Goliaths. Goliaths. Alright. One, two, three, four. Where? No, not Zerglings! Anything but Zerglings! Oh god, at least we uh, at least we got the missile turret. Alright, apparently apparently this is not good. You guys you, you gotta run. Oh well, actually these vultures should be able to save it. There we go. There we go. Yes! Yes! Alright, you guys go in there. All right, actually, let's just uh, let's just lay a bunch of mines. We've got an ultralisk. All right, it's time for mines. This should uh, this should keep this relatively safe. If this doesn't keep it safe, nothing will, because mines are pretty darn good. All right, there we go. All right, all you guys, guess what? You have a new you have a new home. It is all over here. Get one more guy over there. And basically, we're just going to be making lots and lots and lots of Goliaths. Not 
enough minerals. Did I have a lot of guys right now. All right, control five. All right, let's see what we got up ahead. Anything, anything to be too worried about? Not really. All right, can we even get up here? That's the real question. I think I might have to drop that one. But for now, let's just go for somewhere else. Oh my god, I have so many units. Control five. My upgrades are done, right? Or do I have three three still? Yep, gotta do three three. Not enough minerals. All right, give me, give me this. I don't know what it is with these Goliaths, but you know what? Just do whatever it is you want. We're not even going to siege up right now. We are, we are just going crazy town mode. We'll, uh, we'll see what happens, but this army, I mean, it's got to be tough to actually end up losing this, I feel like. Famous last words. All right, we finally have this mining at full capacity. This could probably use a couple more guys, but whatever. Oh god, oh god, Dark Swarm. They have Dark Swarm, pull them out, pull them out. There you go. All right, maybe, maybe I should be sieging up here. You come over here, because Dark Swarm is pretty darn good, actually. All right, we're gonna we're gonna do some siege mode action. Goliath, Goliath, Goliath. Let's get some tanks going again. We're gonna siege those guys up. And actually. What I want to do is send these over here and scan. All right, kill everything. You must kill everything. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. He's the last guy in that hockey group. So I guess we actually did lose almost everything. So maybe, maybe a little more careful, but nah. Now we got uh, we got disposable income, man. Why would we do something like that? You guys can definitely start mining over here, though. Come on, kill the hive. Kill the hive. You can do it. Neutralize that hive. And you guys can go over there. Kill that. Let's go ahead and do another scan up here. They do have a greater spire, but thankfully I haven't seen any guardians lately. Oh, maybe kill the zerglings. Hey, thanks for the uh, thanks for the dark swarm. Come on, kill it, kill it. Yes. All right, no more defilers out of these guys, at least. All right, as long as we take the, keep the tanks rolling. And let's see, I need one more depot, then I'm max on that. This expansion's going pretty swimmingly. I'll go ahead and send an SCB over here, though. Come on, almost enough energy. I should actually probably rebuild some of these. And let's see. Should be able to scan once more. Come on, kill the Hydroden. At least kill something. All right, now kill this. We at least killed the burrowed guys. That's all that matters. All right, so we've cleared out two of the disgusting Zerg bases. Let's uh, let's see what's up here. Now we've got the creep kind of receding. We're gonna even build this command center. There's freaking creep everywhere. Apparently, I can build it over there. Build it right there. All right, let's just see what we got over here. See if there's anything of a uh, great value. Probably not. Definitely loving the tank production, though. I feel like I actually need more factories at this point. That's exactly what I'm gonna do. All right, you guys, actually, let's take these guys off the gas. They aren't, they aren't doing anything. You're gonna come over here. Yes, sir. Ah, who has one now? I think it's you. I think you have got one of sorts. You know what? Kill this. At least try to. Whoever can attack that greater spire should do it. Time to see if there's anything up here. Doesn't look like there is. So that one is going to have to be some sort of drop, which is kind of a pain in the butt, but whatever. Just start making. We're making all the dropships right here, right now. 
We're also making all the additional factories. Because my, my macro has got to be top notch. We got flash macro going on. Yeah, yeah. All right, so we got all these. All right, time to redo some hockey groups. You guys are hockey group number one. All these tanks are hotkey group number two. You guys are all gonna come over here. Oh, that hive is actually in range, so I don't need to do a drop. Screw it. I ain't doing no drop. I'll keep I'll keep one medevac or one uh, dropship alive. That's it. All right, so you guys go over there. And who wants to be hotkey group number three? All right, how about all these Goliaths and this one vulture? All right, that's number three. You guys are gonna come over here. And you are all going to siege. Right there, perfect. You are also going to siege up here. This'll this will be fun. This is this is fun for the whole family right here. Are you guys ready for this scan? I sure am. And scan. Alright, kill the hive! Kill the hive! You can do it! I believe! Are you guys in control group number four? Mixed in with these guys. There's number four. All right, Goliath. Goliath online. Get some more tanks. Get some more Goliaths. All right, we got we got crazy town production. What did you not kill it? All right, one last chance. Come on, just kill that off. There we go. See, was that so bad? Alrighty, let's see. You guys in tank mode. What? What? Alright, well, we gotta go. I, I feel like we don't actually need that base, so we're just going to let that... We're just leaving that one for dead. That's how we're gonna do it. And that should be everyone. Five control groups full of units. Alright, I'm kind of sad about this, though. But whatever. Whatever, we're just gonna go for it. Let's see what we can make happen. Because we have lots of money income right now. Screw it, we're gonna go. We're gonna go over here, you can do it. You can do it. Alright, they probably have guardians, I would assume. You guys might as well see Jeff. Of course they do. Alright, you're coming up here on the high ground. Come on, go up the ramp. Go up the ramp. There you go. Get some pretty go-to positioning here. Alright, kill that Guardian off. Oh, you guys have such long-range missiles. They're so good. They're so good. I just gotta make sure that that's safe. Do we, we save this command center? I think that we did. I know it's a little too late, but we're gonna land it up here anyway. Alright, everyone get into the base. And you guys can unseat now. It is probably safe to march up here, that is for sure. Alright, time for Duran! I feel I feel pretty confident about this uh, about this win. Can I can I just say that? I felt like my macro was impeccable. Yes, I know there was times I had tons of extra tons of extra, but whatever. Whatever. Just scanning, making sure there's no baddies on the way. And as soon as Duran gets... We're even going to cloak him just to play it safe. Alright, this one got completely knocked out. I think I've killed almost every single building in the game. Except for uh, except for the ones up here. So you guys can go have some fun. Alright, here we go. Unload there. Duran is right next to this. I think we are all ready to go. Right when the Goliaths get to have all their fun too. Oh my god, is that... Hang on, is that Zergling blocking me? Oh, so uncool. We get, we gotta land this and then we'll be and then we'll be set. Just uh, just to stick it to the Zerg. All right, there we go. Yes. Captain, we've located the side disruptor. Shall we plant the explosives on it? Lieutenant Duran, we're here to relieve you. We've come with orders from Admiral Stukov himself to facilitate the disruptor's disassembly. Very well. Take it away, Captain. I'll be returning to the command ship presently. Oh, the plot's thickening even more and more. I'm actually, I'm actually getting kind of excited. I honestly don't remember exactly what happens here, but uh, I crushed all y'all in score, definitely in the units count, man. All right, a 27-minute game, not too bad. Let's go ahead and continue on in the next video. Hope you guys enjoy it, and I'll see you guys next time. 
Hello everyone, this is HDS Guest here, back with some more Brood War playthrough campaign action. Of course, we're picking up right where we left off, uh, uh, at the, uh, the Assault on Core Hall, that's what I'm trying to say here. And UED flagship Alexander, low orbit over the planet Core Hall, Dominion Throne World. Captain, once again, your leadership has set a fine example to the rest of my officers. Vice Admiral Stukov has informed me that the Psy Disruptor has been accounted for, so we can now proceed with the next phase of our operation. The time has come to begin our primary invasion of the Dominion Throne World of Korhal. Alexei, fill the Captain in on the current situation. As you may know from your research, Captain, Korhal was a hotbed of anti-Confederate sentiment for years. The Confederacy hoped to contain Korhal's civil unrest by decimating it and its population with a massive nuclear barrage. Though the radiation levels on the planet are at an all-time low, its surface is now nothing more than a smoldering desert. The catch, Admiral, is that because this world has already been devastated by nuclear fire, Mengsk has no compunction against using nukes on us. We have detected a large cluster of missile silos on the outskirts of Augustgrad. If those silos were destroyed, we believe that Mengsk would lose his core nuclear capabilities. We also face a different obstacle, Captain. Intelligence has informed us that Mengsk employs multiple battle cruisers for his planetary defense. It is possible to nullify these battle cruisers by taking out strategic physics labs. Without these labs, Manx will be unable to power up his ship's weapon systems. Though we know how to compensate for Manx's defenses, we don't have enough time to follow through on them both. Therefore, Captain, you must choose to either counter his nuclear capabilities or his battle cruisers. Once you've taken care of this operation, we can begin to plan our final assault against Augustgrad. All right, so I mean, we have to decide what do we hate more, ghosts or uh, battle cruisers? I'm more inclined to lean towards hating ghosts more, but uh, we'll see. We'll see which one is the easy route. Let's see what I got going on here. Uh, okay, looks like there's basically three ways into this base. Perfect. Just what I wanted. And let's go and get the gas going right away. I've learned on these missions that gas is a scarcity. Although, so far this campaign has been mostly TBT. I think we had that one TBZ in the last game and haven't seen any Protoss around lately. So, uh, not quite sure what those guys are up to. Let's let's go ahead and reorganize this base a little bit. Let's spread things out. Make it a little bit easier to uh, find where we're going. And let's go ahead and land this right there. That was, that was kind of the problem in the last game is that I everything was so far spread out. Let's, uh, wait, wait, let's switch these. Let's do one, two, three, and then you're gonna land there. There we go. I think that I think that should work out correctly. Hopefully, I calculated this correctly, and I did. Alrighty, good enough. And upgrades vitally important. So we'll go ahead and work on those right away. Let's go and throw this guy into the gas. Let's you're throwing in there as well. So now we're gonna macro up a little bit. But we do have rates. Yeah, attack formation. All right, so we got that. Good to go. Uh, that actually has full energy, so I should use this right away. Uh, what's over here? Nothing over there? Ah, I see you guys. I see you. I bet I can attack them from, like, right there. And let's just see what's up here. Just some siege tanks hanging out. All right, that was a great waste of energy, but whatever. It is showing us what they got. And more SCVs on the way. I kind of want to go for siege mode right away just because it's so... Super important. Let's make one medic. We gotta, we gotta Sasha's fest over here. Let's be honest. We gotta, we gotta mix in some of the ladies, keep the morale up, and got that upgrade on the way. So I think everything is pretty good to go. And the green range is a very important upgrade as well. Although I can't help but wonder, am I just gonna go for more mech, or am I actually gonna go for bio? Because versus siege tanks, either way, it's gonna be. Oh God! Oh, where did these come from? Where the hell did these fire bats come from? Wow, they actually killed like multiple. Oh, apparently, is there four ways into my base? Jeez. All right, well, this medic's gonna have her work cut out for. Her. Gotta heal up all these uh, SCVs and stuff. Yeah, work on work on dealing with those. 
I think I need to take out this base first, because that is that is gonna prove to be annoying. So siege tanks it is. Got that on the way. Siege mode is of course on the way as well. I need to build some stuff up there. Alright, idle SCB, you need to come up here. And supply depot. Put it right there. Play us out in range of those tanks I scanned. Thank you. Got my siege mode on, got my SCV count pretty high. We're gonna keep making these though. Because there's a lot of mineral patches here. So Jax has me a little bit worried because that means it may be a long mission. But all I know is I have to secure my borders as best as I possibly can. Let's go ahead and put you right there. So if I need a tank or two for defense, not to mention. Hey, wait, no, you're gonna you're gonna be defending down here. And there we go. Yeah, not to mention get up an army. I also have to defend it, so it, it's gonna be a minute. It's gonna be a minute to secure all this. As long as I'm making lots of workers, though, that is all that really matters. Let's let's get some guys mining these patches. Yes, sir. Orders, Captain. And are you actually are you doing anything? All right, we got that one upgrade. I'm wondering though if I should build an armory down here. I will definitely need missile turrets. I feel like so we're gonna put one right here. You can do it. You can do it. You can do it. We can do it. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Oh my god. Pathing is so bad. There we go. We actually got it. Very nice. Very nice. Alright, so you're going to go to siege mode get another tank. This guy's nearly done, but we're going to put one more depot here. So I want a tank at either corner. What? What? What's happening? Not my rates. Anything but my rates. You guys repair that. Go there. I guess we're just gonna keep uh, keep on scanning. More, okay, so I think our SCV count's looking pretty good. Just need more tanks. I'll probably build another armory pretty soon. But for now, I need this tank up here. You're gonna come down here and build that. And you are going to siege right there. All right, as soon as I have one tank and one turret in every location, I'm going to be okay with that. Why do you guys stop? I swear they're doing this on purpose. All right, so you build a turret there, and then I think we're going to be in pretty good shape to start making an entire army. Which I'm pretty excited about. All right, another tank. So you can actually come over here and be part of this group. And you're going to go there. we got to find all these guys who are done building. You're one of them. This should be the next one. So you are actually going to build an armory, and then you're going to come over here, and then you are going to build a depot. Perfect! Alright, so we have, we have secured our borders. We got uh, some pretty good macro going on. At least I feel like it. You two should just siege up. You can go back to work. You can build. See, that could we could wall it off completely, but I don't actually want to do that. So we're going to do that. You're going to get that add-on. I might actually need... Should I make a third Order, one? I don't know. Sir. Almost have the armory, though, so that's going to be nice. Yes, sir. All right, everything else should be good. Yes, sir. That should be... No, let's just make more SCVs. Screw it. More depots as well. And we are basically ready to head out. Aha! How you like my wallet, buddy? Apparently, they're just going to go straight for the add-on. So that's, that's not good. There we go, should be able to deal with that. Vulture ain't got nothing on me, baby. All right, so there's that, get another armory. Oh god, he locked something down. Oh, can you not fit through there? What? Oh, wait, wait, yes you can. All right, you psyched me out a little bit. Psyched me out just a little bit. So we're gonna repair that. I think what I wanna kill though is the ghosts when it comes to that, but for now I wanna kill his base over here. All right, there's that, rally point over here. All right, I think we're basically ready. You guys are going to be control group number two. All you guys are number one. I'm just going to keep doing this. I think I also want to build a command center up here. All right, let's do this. Two. Go ahead and siege. Don't really care if I lose some of these Marines, but don't want to lose the race. 
Okay, awesome. Let's go ahead and get you building this right there. Let's see what's over there. Take all that out. So far, so good. And I will take it. All right, so you are going to build that right there. More SCBs, more tanks, and more depots. All the depots. All right, what's going on? Who's attacking me? No, kill it. Don't let him lock you down. Don't let him lock you down. Very nice. All right, let's actually put this guy kind of in between. I also need a starport. This. What? What did I start researching? No, wait, wait, let me do, let me do starport first. And I think it's actually going to be enough for you guys. Put another one right there. And armor upgrade, there we go, okay. Good enough, I don't know where these guys came from, but we should definitely kill them off. All right, they don't really have any tanks in position yes, here, so sir. I can go ahead and safely ahead. move on down. Yes, sir. This guy is a little bit damaged, so we're going to save him. Yes, sir. There we go. That's what I'm talking about. Okay, tank. Probably should get some more... Uh... Actually, let's see. Can I cancel this tank? Yes, sir. Now what's the hotkey? I? Right away, sir. All right, I gotta, I gotta get something to detect. We're gonna come over here. I think this is the damaged one, so you can go ahead and repair that. All right, vultures are pretty awesome. So we're gonna get lots of those. We're gonna do this as the add-on. Come on. All right, you come up there. Get the add-on, there we go. Well played. All right, I think we can go ahead and move these guys down. Oh, careful with the rates. Careful with the rates. Oh, oh, they're not ready to. Uh, they're not ready to move in. The previous tenants have not moved out yet. Nope, come over here. Come over here. And siege, 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 siege. Oh god, they got a tank there. All right, you got to repair that. Just lots of vultures, I, I, I guess. Yeah, I guess we should. We're, we're going back. That's the only way to do it. Uh, you guys are looking pretty good. You are trapped, which means it's time for you to die. What am I making that's taking a lot of gas? Oh, double upgrades. Okay. All right, whatever. Ow, ah, where'd they get all these units? Where'd they get all these units? Oh, God, they're building another... No, the siege tanks. Where's my SCB? You must save this SCB. Save the tanks. Right, there we go for now. And let's just let's just get lots of vultures. Maybe maybe I can just send the vultures in. Right, you're you're gonna back up a little bit. You're coming over here. Right, here comes the vultures. We at least have the science facility now, so I can get these upgrades. This is basically going to be worthless, so not too concerned about that. Oh, vultures, you're so silly. Oh, you're the new control one. Oh god, put mines over here. Put mines everywhere! This will help, this will help defend it anyway. There we go. Careful. Careful of the mines. Okay. I think we can begin producing tanks again. I definitely need more factories, though. Alright, SCB, go repair this guy. Alright, so we gotta get these guys into position. Maybe up here. Should be able to take out those reeds quite easily. What is this? Basically, I need more factories. That's uh, that's all there is to it, so I'm going to build some more. Oh, God. They got so many guys here. What the hell happened? All right, siege mode. 
go ahead and land this over here. I need you guys actually kill this off. The siege tank should be able to deal with the rest. Alright, kill that off. You should be able to land there now. Oh god, I see a lot of guys coming down here. Hopefully my tanks can deal with it. Alright, time to back up. Who cares about those vultures? They're basically free units. Oh god. Come on, Siege Tank. You can do it. Drag him down. No, repair it. Repair it. Save the tank. No! Why is this tank not in range? Alright. Nope. Alright, whatever. You guys go back to work. We need more factories. We need lots more factories. You also need to come over here, though. Guard this. Alright, you go there. And basically what I need is a bunch of these guys to come down here. Are you serious? One marine? Man, they definitely make you, uh, they make you stretch. Okay, let's go build that there. I guess we can plant some mines here just to be safe. Oh, there's nothing in there. Thank goodness there's no one in that bunker. Alright, should be able to take out this. Whoops! That was a misclick, my bad! All right, here we go. We we are gonna have so many vultures. You guys are gonna know what to do with them. Uh, maybe one more guy in gas. Is that, is that kind of problem here? All right, screw it. Queue up all the vultures. And more depots. What? Did I lose my science facility? Gosh darn it. It would definitely appear that I lost my fine science facility. Alright, B, I. Are you stuck back there? Yes, you are. Alright, we're gonna have so many vultures, it's gonna be just silly. Alright, finally got this gas up. I'm gonna put three guys in here just to be extra safe. Boom, 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 boom. And nothing really remaining down here, so that's nice. All right, vultures. Please tell me you were worth it. You're probably not, but might as well. Might as well start planting some mines. God, the pathing is so bad. How did anyone play Terran back in the day? That's the real question. Wait, is this a base right here? Oh god, there's just fire bats in there. The one time vultures are good. Aha! How you like it, you stupid cloak ghost? Why did you guys get so close? the fire bat. Alright, time for some goliaths. Also, I need my science facility back. Alright, so you, you're gonna build a science facility. All you guys just gotta go lay more mines. Where are their upgrades at? They're at 111. Alright, I think I can finally start getting goliaths now. Yeah, let's get lots of goliaths. Alright, more mines just to, uh, just have them planted everywhere because they're awesome. Your forces are, under attack. are my forces under attack? Yes, they are. Can we save that guy in time from the one Marine? Yep. Alright, there's that. More going on with the mines. Basically, you guys are disposable here, so just uh, just to let you know. I know we need more depots. Alright, more depot. I think I'm actually getting a little bit low on money, so. Let's build some SCVs. Are you guys all stuck back here? Alright, we're gonna lift you off. We're gonna put you over here. Actually, let's uh let's delay this. Let's organize this a little bit better. You guys all come over here. Organization is key, guys. Just remember that. Alright, so. Tank. No, let's just make more Goliaths. What's attacking me? Really? Really? Come on, vultures, get out of the way. There we go. Oh god, they got they got cloaking now. Alright, we took that out. You guys are over here. Now it's time to land these bad boys. Alright, so you land there. You land here. You land somewhere not on top of these guys. Alright, you land up here. 
And now it's Goliath time. I don't even know if I can build supply depots quickly enough for this. Come on. You can do it. You can do it. Okay, that should be good. I feel like this base is secure. So we're going to send all these guys. Alright, let's do let's do some hot key groups now. You guys are control group number one. We also gotta work on these upgrades. Two is going to be all you guys. Oh god, that's not that's not a good place to be. Alright, well it was nice knowing you, hotkey group number one. Alright, let's see. I wanna send everyone in the same place so I can see what I've got, but. Okay, so hotkey group number one, that is you guys. You're over here now. Let's make you guys. You guys are hotkey group number two. Uh, who else wants to be in hotkey group number two? Alright, you're part of that one and two. We got all that. You guys are number three. Actually, let's just, uh, let's just slowly push down here. Alright, that's gotta be the safest way of doing that. And maybe, maybe some more tanks, some more goliaths. And let's go ahead and just try this. I don't know how well this is gonna work out. Probably not very. Wait, wait, you guys can go this way. You can do it! There you go, you're spot the high ground! Alright, Goliath should be able to spot all these. Take them out. Take them out, that stupid tank! Come on, Vulture, you can do it! Get right on top! There you go! You're the hero! Are you guys scout down here? No, back up, back up. Alrighty, we're gonna try. We're gonna go for it. Make a dash. Make a bad dash for it. You can do it. Oh god, you can't do it. You can't do it. There's so many units down here. Alright, alright. We may have lost the battle. And we've probably lost the war, but we're gonna we're gonna say that we haven't. Are right, you gonna we're gonna leave this guy up there? Alright, here we go. Now now we're talking. What is this? Is there a siege tank down here still? Yep. These guys are actually doing quite a bit of damage here. Can you, can you, are you out of range over here? I think that they are, yes, okay. Okay, basically we just gotta start sieging up some tanks, man. That is all there is to it. Yes, I think we got it. I think we've breached the defenses. By Jove, I think we've done it. Are you guys are still doing good? Killing all the reinforcements. Those are just spider mines, so they're not doing a lot of good. All right, siege mode for you. And we've got it. We have done it. That Goliath's getting left back at home. Get out of here, stupid scanted. Oh yeah, just sit back and relish in the victory. Woo! God, stupid level, man. They they give you a base where you can just get attacked. We won't need to worry about nukes when we siege Max Pass. Yep, no nukes for Minx, cause I I kind of hate nukes, and I'm not gonna lie. Yes, I know you can see the red dot. Yes, I know the game tells you. But I would rather just kill their main set of battle cruisers using a bunch of Goliaths because Goliaths are awesome. So, woo! Oh, that was that was really loud, man. It's uh, Puberty 2.0 here. But anyways, let's go ahead and continue. Hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you guys next time. Hello, everyone. This is HPS Guest here. Back with some more Brood War campaign playthrough action. We just got done denying them nukes. So we are going to go ahead, and I believe it's the Birds of War. It actually gives you two options here once you defeat mission number four. But uh, let's find out. Emperor's Fall, Birds of War, UED Command Center near the outskirts of Ag Augustograd, capital city of Korhal. Captain, Admiral de Gaulle has ordered a final tactical meeting before the siege of Augustograd commences. I'll patch you through to his war room. 
Ah, Captain, we've been expecting you. As you may have guessed, we are coordinating our final attack plans. You should know that even though Manx cannot reinforce his numbers, his standing forces are substantial. Manx is an accomplished tactician, so you had best be wary of any counterattacks he may attempt. I'm Captain. Remember that although we disabled Ming's nuclear capabilities, he still commands a large number of battle cruisers. We suspect that he will use these ships against us at every turn. Be on your guard, Captain. Show this Emperor what the UED thinks of his rule. All right, no nukes, but uh, they are going to have lots and lots and lots of battle cruisers. So, oh, oh, misclick, misclick all day. And there's that. All right, let's take a look around at exactly what we've got here. Uh, well, it looks like a pretty big base. Battle cruisers are apparently operational. And I can only assume that they are headed my way. Shields up, weapons online. Oh God. Maybe, maybe, uh, maybe just leave me out of this. Thankfully, they do give you a lot of supply depots, but they don't give you a lot of uh, a lot of production facilities. So we shall see. All right, well, if they attack my main base, I got one Marine. I got my main, my main man, Bob, over here. The one, the one single Marine. I'm gonna, I'm gonna throw these guys in gas right away. See if I care. Because gas is a total pain in the butt to get. Hey, reinforcements. I will, I will take reinforcements. What have you got? What have you got for me, game? Uh, Goliaths? Ghosts? All right, all right, not bad. Maybe Marines will go in here. We'll put the ghost back here. And basically, I'm just going to keep making as many SCVs as I can. I got Goliath. This is a great way to deal with the battle cruisers. Oh, God. Are they coming for me? Are they coming for me? Let's find out. Why, why, do I, why can't I help but feel they're going to come for me? See, oh, there they are. There they are. All right, here we go. Lock it down. All too easy. All too easy, baby. Oh, oh, oh dear. Oh dear. Oh god. Oh, uh, uh, no, my hotkeys. No, my hotkeys. Oh no, did I mess it up? I think I messed this up. I, I have made. I have greatly. I have messed up. Oh god, have I messed up or what? Have I messed up or what? All right, hang on. Hang on, we can still do this. We can still do this. You're all going to repair this one Goliath. And these guys are going to kill this off. All right, mass repair. Mass repair, everyone repair it. Everyone repair it. Repair is OP, you can do it. You can do it. Everyone repair that one. No, oh, they killed one. All right, one left. One left, okay, who's he shooting? He's attacking this one, okay. We so have got this. You guys go back to work. Yes. All right, you guys, you guys should all probably go back to work now. All right. Well, that would have been a lot better if I just uh, used cloak and then locked them down. But you know, but you know, I'm gonna blame the lag. Which actually, there is a little bit of lag because I am uh, rendering a video right now, and I'm like, you know what? I want to play more StarCraft. Uh, evidently, not the best idea, as uh, they send a million battle cruisers at you right away. So we uh, we gotta recover from that. It's gonna take a little bit, but thankfully. Thankfully, I saved the majority of my SCVs. My command center did not get killed, because if it did, then that would just be depressing. And yeah, this is all I have left of my reinforcements, so good job. Good job, Goliath. You uh, really stepped it up for the team. All right, so what is it that I'm actually going to need to make here? Uh, I guess I could start with a factory. So we'll go ahead and get that right away. I think mech is still going to be the way to go. And you know what? My... Uh, my house is really hot. I got, I got to turn on the AC. Hang on. SCB, good to go, sir. SCB, good to go, sir. And I'm back. And look, I magically have a, uh, a bunch of money to spend, so that's great. Pretty, pretty excited about that. Do we never build my... I never build my factory, turns out. So we're going to go ahead and throw that down. Maybe even throw multiple factories down, actually. I feel like that is the way to go. Maybe even another one. Okay. 
got lots of factories on the way. We got lots of SCBs on the way. Are you gonna have enough money to do that? Yes, you are. All right, three factories, baby. Go ahead and set all the rally points down here. SCVs are good to go. And I think we're basically fully saturated right now. Got upgrades on the way. Got my three Goliaths over here. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, you can do it, Goliaths. You can do it. Yes. All right, we definitely got to repair these guys, though. These guys, these guys are the champions of my army right now. That is just a fact. So we're going to get that. More SCVs. I want to try and go straight to Siege Tank and Goliath. Because that is a pretty reliable unit composition. All right, so you're going to go down there. And you guys, I think we're going to have quite a few extra SCVs here. Go ahead and do that. And this one, you are going to be making an armory. We'll build it up there. And some vultures. Since you don't need an add-on on every single building, because you can get you can get Goliaths and vultures without the add-on. You just have to get the armory first. All right, so we got to get that. How many guys? Do I have enough guys? Here? We're going to put one more just to be safe. And you're going to do that. You, however, are going to give me mines and another tank. There we go. Now we're now we're doing okay. As long as I keep the vultures alive, we got to repair that guy though. We have got to get these guys back in the field. And I wonder if I can secure this place safely. Let's go find out. All right, so we're good there. Good there. Vultures on the way. To repair all of them. Nope, this guy still needs it. And tank. Almost enough for another tank. Yeah, tanks are so cheap. Tanks are so cheap. All right, I think we're I think we're good on this front. No more, no more workers. That's the last one. We're gonna come down here. For now, let's just build additional vultures. All right, so do I have mines yet? Nope, not quite yet. But I do have siege mode, baby. So I feel like we can safely do this. Come down here. We're gonna go there. Our income's about as efficient as it's going to get. Oh, this guy needs to build another supply depot. And I kind of just want to build a command center up here. I don't know if it's gonna be, be very safe or not, but at the same time, I really want it. All right, so you're gonna go over there. You're gonna go over there. I'll probably have to start getting some Goliaths soon. But for now, it's time for a command center. Might actually put two command centers up here. There's a lot of money to be had. Which is why I kind of want to build more of these. Alright, so for now, let's go ahead and build some turrets here, just to be safe. Go ahead and build some more of these guys. And... Oh god, I'm already maxed out on supply. My macro is too good! And by too good, I mean too bad, because I'm getting supply blocked. Alright, so those things are on the way. He's got his command center. I should probably build some turrets up here. Go ahead and put that there. Vultures. Alright. Let's go ahead and plant these mines, man. Okay, we saw someone come from over here. So we gotta get we gotta get these mines going. Alright, so plant some mines there, there, and there. Very nice. Maybe come check up here, see if they can send anything. Actually, some of these guys should probably just long distance mine. So you guys are gonna start that. More depots, because we are gonna need those no matter what we go. And get some Goliaths. Alright. Oh god, what is this? No! I knew it! Alright, SMEs, get out of there. Get out of there. You can do it. You can do it. Where are the vultures at? Where are the vultures at? No, these Marines! Ah! There we go. There we go. Should be able to deal with that. Alright, where's that stupid fireman? Oh god. Oh god, not the SMEs. Alright, well, that long distance mining was a terrible idea. All right, how many of these guys we got left? All right, we got a couple. We go ahead and plant some mines up here. Yeah. Yeah, get a lot of those going. As long as we, as long as we get quite a few. Oh, what's this? Oh god, that's a battle cruiser. All right, thankfully I made a Goliath at least. Oh, I knew it. I knew you were gonna do that. All right, go ahead and kill that. But yeah, we definitely gotta build turrets down here. Come on, Goliath, you can do it. You can do it. More Goliaths. More Goliaths. All right, let's try and uh, send some more of these guys up here. All right, we gotta we gotta get the economy going again. 
Alright, there's that. And nope, you need to repair this one. Alright, so you guys wait, what happened? Did he did he kill it? I don't, I don't understand. Maybe it burned down or something. Alright, so there's that. And now our economy is looking a-okay-ish. Are you guys over here? There we go. Uh, I guess they already have Goliath range. That's kind of what I'm gathering. Not enough minerals. And more and more SCBs, because we lost quite a few in that engagement. We're still we're still recovering. Remember that we kind of uh, botched that first attack, so. That's just that's just something to keep in mind. You go there. You go there. Where are my vultures at? There they are. Alright, you guys come over here, lay mines. Lay mines. You don't have any mines left, neither do you. Alright, you're all out, you're all out. Okay, I think we have every entrance at least semi mined. Ready to roll out! And I should probably build more turrets here. Because they definitely are enjoying sending those at me. Alright, Goliath. Tank. Tank. Oh, you can't make a tank. You gotta make just Goliath then. Alright, as long as I get uh, lots of minerals, I'm gonna be good. Because my gas income's decent. We got three missile turrets. Soon to be four. Let's go ahead and do that. Ah, you heard my video stop rendering, didn't you guys? Now the game's gonna run better. Oh yes. For those of you who don't know, I actually multitask way too much sometimes. I'm like, yeah, I gotta wait 20 minutes for this video to render, or, or I can render it and play more StarCraft. All right, there's that and that. All right, let's see. We got a control group of Goliaths. Definitely need to keep those going. I also need to make an armory up here. So we're gonna go ahead and build that. Next, I need a starport. So, we're gonna get that. You guys should actually probably come up here. And how about there? And there. Just trying to get as much surface area as I can. More SCVs, the more the merrier. I think we need one more guy in gas down here. Some more Goliaths. And I am gonna work on. I wonder if going battle, like mass battle cruisers, is that what I should actually do? What do you guys think? I think I, I imagine I can go battle cruiser at this point. Actually, what I need to do is do the uh, academy. Wait, uh, what is BA? There we go. That's the hotkey I'm remembering. All right, more SCVs over here, the better. I mean, Goliaths are super useful versus everything. But I can go for battle cruisers finally, so that may have to be that may have to be what I go for. I think I'm going to. I'll let this upgrade finish. But I think it's time. I think it's time to show them who's boss with some battle cruisers. Hopefully they don't have lockdown. I got rid of their nukes, but I don't know if I got rid of their ghosts completely. All right, you guys need to keep making depots down here. See how much space depots used to make or used to take up? It is so ridiculous. All right, so there's that and ship upgrades. All right, so if nothing else, I have these Goliaths for uh, some pretty stellar defense. Confirmed. And I definitely want to back them up with lots. Let's uh, let's just go scout around. I'm also gonna work on the other upgrade for this in case my in case my battle cruiser strategy doesn't work. We have to rely on just vultures. All right, so let's get the comsat. Your forces are under attack. Another one. What do they got over here? All right, so they got some defenses up there. Can this guy actually fit through here? Hopefully, I didn't mess that up. Oh god, battle cruisers. But guess what? I got Goliaths! Goliaths are indeed online. And they are pretty freaking good. Alright, so we have to get this add on. You have to put. Let's see, actually, I can land that right there. Wait, 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 wait. Wait, build it right there. And even another one. We're gonna, we're gonna go crazy sauce with this. We're gonna go ultimate crazy sauce. Okay, so. I'm right, my one vulture up here. Let's just let's just see what he's got. Also, gotta build more depots because they take up a million years, uh, a million years to build all those. No problem. All right, so nothing up there. We'll see what's kind of going over here. So apparently that's the uh, that's the thing I gotta kill. Ah, aha, civilians! Oh god, oh god, battle cruisers. Um, that's actually a lot of battle cruisers. So I need to send this Goliath up here. Yeah. Depending on how pissed we just made them. God, these things are so fast. All right, battle cruiser time. More add-ons. Come on, get out of the way. Get out of the way. We need more add-ons. We also need more depots, so you guys are gonna help out. Come on. 
Out of the way! Out of the way! You're getting in my way of battle cruisers. Oh, fire bat. Patrol micro! Patrol micro! That's how the pros do it, man. Nope. Nope. Bring him into the mines. Here we go. Minefield. Oh, it feels so good. Yeah, that feels great every time. All right, another battle cruiser. I don't think I'm gonna be able to produce four at a time forever, but we're, we're gonna try anyways. And might as well, might as well just make 800 million vultures, just because I have the money and I have the supply currently. So I'm not gonna feel bad about it. All right, so you go there, you go there. More upgrades. All right, these battle cruisers are gonna be ridiculous. They're gonna be so much better than Minx Minxes. So for now, just lots of vultures. I could even throw down another factory if I wanted to. All right, let's kill these stupid civilians, because that's the important part. All right, there we go. Take them out, take them out, back it up, back it up, back it up. How many these freaking things have they got, man? Focus fire. Everybody needs to focus fire. Am I taking a lot of damage or something? How did that, how did that Goliath get over here? All right, you guys gotta come back here and kill this. I don't think the vulture's gonna be able to handle it. All right, kill that off. Oh, that vulture didn't stand a chance. All right, how are the upgrades going? I'm gonna work on armor. All right, one more supply depot, and then we're done with that. We got our first battle cruisers finishing up. Definitely not enough to produce four at a time, that is for sure. If only wraiths just cost minerals, that would be amazing. Oh, God. Come over here. Hang on. Well, that means they do have ghosts, so definitely, definitely good to know. All right, kill that ghost. Kill that ghost. Stupid lock. God, freaking lockdown. Freaking lockdown. I thought I hot keep this. Evidently not. There we go. There we go. Should still be able to kill them. At least ghosts have, like, no HP. Apparently, they have a million lockdowns, though, so that's a thing. Something on your mind? All right. Yes, something is on my mind, and it is your suicide mission. All right, another battle cruiser, please. We're just gonna, we're just gonna have some fun with these guys. All right, first we got plant mines. Might as well get as many of these mines out here as we can, because they had like a million ghosts. All right, actually, we should. Uh, can, you, can you actually make it up here? Let's find out. Okay, cool. All right, plant a million mines. You guys go over there and plant mines. You plant some. You plant some. Come up here. I don't want any more ghosts up in my face. With all their stupid lockdowns. No problem. Lang mines is very, very time. Wait, why am I planting up there? There's nothing up there. Maybe, maybe plant some right here. Battle cruiser Battle cruiser. All right, give me some more battle cruisers. And of course, some more vultures, because we got a lot of those to spare. What are you on? All right, we got we got quite the minefield here. Nothing's making it through this. Nothing is making it through this at all. I think this is the guy with the last mines. And really, you just mostly you just mostly buy vultures for the mines anyway, so. These guys, these guys are doing great. Ow, well, battle cruisers are not so great. Definitely not so great on the battle cruiser, but. Alright, these guys should actually be able to kill that. Alright, so you guys are gonna be the replacements. While everyone else comes over here. And we definitely have to free up some of the supplies, so. There we go, take it out. Back up. Very nice. All right, let's do this. Let's do this. Take out that bunker. You are not designed to kill buildings, but that's what you're going to be used for. Wait, I definitely need, uh, definitely need that. And more battle cruisers. Oh, I'm out of, I'm out of supply. I don't think I'm losing these quickly enough. But we did kill another battle cruiser. That's nice. All right, what's up here? Just a bunker. You guys kill it. You guys can kill it, right? Just get on the high ground. There you go. Because remember, Brood War, you have a chance to miss if you're on the low ground. Oh god, is this going to be enough? Why are you attacking a turret? Why are you not attacking the Goliaths? Come on. Come on, there you go. Kill that one. Oh god. Oh god! Woo! That was super close. Actually, let's send uh, yeah, you guys down here to kill this. And in the meantime, we're going to build more and more battle cruisers. I think I can even build another one. There we go. And any more, any more vultures? I think there's a group over here. You guys go over there. 
Part help out with these uh, kind of derpy goliaths. Is there a base over here, or what's actually over there? Something on your mind? Okay, this is all that's no left of control problem. group number one. Eh, let's add to it. Hey, there is a base over here. But do you have gas? I don't think they do. Oh, they do. Oh, I'm so gonna go grab that. So grabbing that. What do you want? All right. What is this? Oh, kill him! Kill him with the patrol micro. Very nice. Well played. All right, sweet. So That—that's a lot of money invested on upgrades. Whatever. Oh god, where's the Goliaths? Where's the Goliaths? They're all the way over here. Oh dear. Well, I guess I can just use my own battle cruisers. I feel like I actually don't need tanks anymore. I feel like these are actually just taking up supplies. So we are going to add these to control group number one with these wonderful Hellions over here. Why did that mine just burrow? I got, oh, I see. All right, so you guys are gonna just go attack something. I don't know what yet. Oh, apparently there's a tank right here. Everyone get close, get nice and close. And more, more battle cruisers, yes. Upgrades are doing good, I think we're at 2-2. All right, we're gonna send these guys off on their own, we'll see what happens. We gotta make room for more and more battle cruisers. Oh, mines! Oh, here we go. Oh, God, there's so many mines. All right, let's try this for a change. Yeah, oh my God. Apparently you can't do splash damage to mines. That is that is taking forever. There we go. Clean out those mines. We gotta we gotta make more supply for our battle cruiser so if you die, it's totally okay. All right, do we kill everything? Very nice. All right, let us continue forth. These Hellions shall be in pursuit as well. All right, so you guys, nope, nope, come up here. Come on, come on, go across the bridge. There we go. Should be in range of all that. And got enough for another battle cruiser. We are going to have so many battle cruisers. Did my SCV ever make it up here? I guess I never sent one, huh? All right, you're coming up here. You are definitely building that there. Which means you guys are planting mines up here. Actually, plant them down here. Nope, up here. Something on your mind. Just plant mines every. I wish there was a plant mines everywhere, but it's called being Flash. Flash is really good at this game. Flash is good at planting mines. We'll give him that. All right, there we go. That should be enough to uh, lock down that location. All right, so here we go. Just continue on through. Absolutely. I know where mines are in there. God, your pathing is so bad. Your pathing is bad, you should feel bad, tanks. That's okay, that's why we love this game. Alright, we're doing pretty good there. Almost maxed out on battle cruisers. Another base is over here, very nice. Definitely want to get this going right away. And take out the bunker. Taking all these units and we're slowly working our way up there. Stupid high ground advantage. Something on your mind? Let's just plant mines here just because we got them. Oh god. Oh, this is not going to be pretty. This is not going to be pretty. Stupid lockdown. Alright, we may have to hang out here for a little bit. Something on your mind? Oh god, they got their own tanks now. No, wait, wait, cancel that. We need more battle cruisers. Alright, command center is done. Must send up some more SCVs up to the new base. Gotta get this gas going as soon as possible. Actually, this one should have full energy now, yeah? Where is that tank from? Oh, there he is. There we go. Taking him out. Alright, you go in there. You and you as well are going to go in there because we want to make sure we're mining gas at full efficiency. Ah, uh, that one's depleted. That would explain it. All right, you guys are going to come up here. All right, you're going to be control number eight. And let's see what else we got up here. 
Not really a whole lot. So you guys, you guys are doing good. I should build a science vessel. I know that. Receiving transmission. And I should also get you. I don't think I ever got you mana cannon, did I? Nope. Just the extra energy. All right. So we finally got that gas income. So that's nice. No gas over here, so to speak. Destination. To speak of. Absolutely. All right. Anyone else in this group that I need to bring along? Bring along for the right. Ah, there are two tanks over here. She's gonna be part of that group. Let's even bring these Goliaths down. Just for the fun of it. Uh, anyone got energy? Nope. How are these vultures still alive? That's the real question. Oh god, I don't have the. Wait, yes, I do. Scan him out. Take him down. Kill it. Kill the ghost. Don't let the ghost escape at any cost. Oh my god, I'm gonna have so many Valkyries. This is going to be ridiculous. I also have. Wait, do I not have guys on gas over here? Or something? What's the deal? I feel like maybe we're missing a guy on gas. Let's just, let's just put a couple on there. Oh god, do I have scans anywhere? Alright, kill the Wraith first. Kill the Wraith. Kill the other Wraith. There you go. That's how you do it. Right, my Valor Cruiser is fully really upgraded now. Oh, he killed one with his last shot. That is not cool. All right, I think we're I think we're ready to move out with this. Nice EMP, bro. And you guys are gonna be control group number two. We should have more battle cruisers. Almost done, and we do. All right, you guys get more here. Your forces are under attack. Yeah, they do have a lot of Valor Cruisers. Alright, so. Engage. Intercept these ones. Frequencies open. Yamada. Yo, mama. No, they're gonna do it to us, too. Not cool. Make it happen. Not cool at all. Oh, God, science vessel. There's the EMP. Can't really dodge that with Battle Cruisers, though. I mean, let's be honest. Alright, you guys siege up. Finally, have some decent gas income. That's nice. Your forces are Alright, battle cruisers are nice and slow. Alright, not really a whole lot over there, not as much as I would have thought anyway. Alright, you guys are gonna come up here. Actually, you can see. You can see. Oh, mines! They, well, so much for the tanks. We'll see. Uh, we'll see how the battle cruisers fare. Hopefully, a little bit better than that, because that was that was an embarrassment. All right, science vessel, you can do it. Absorb all the damage, battle cruiser. You are the chosen one. Get some good old defensive matrix. And let's see. I guess just more battle cruisers. So far, I'm building them quicker than I'm losing them, so that's nice. And we're getting pretty darn close. As long as they don't mass lock down me, I should be okay. But what other chance do you get to build this many battle cruisers? It's like I'm a kid again. Battle cruiser, battle cruiser. All right, whatever. Let's see. Another two have done. Hey, what do you think you're doing, Vulture? Go kill something. Alright, all you guys need to come up here. Definitely have a lot of SCBs. Oh, well, he uh, he stood a chance, I'm sure. Oh god, one Goliath. Do we have turrets over here to defend? Do they know about this base? They can't have this base. Oh god. Oh god, alright, alright, you gotta buy time. You gotta buy as much time as you can, we gotta get these turrets up. Oh god, he's trapped. Alright, uh, draw him over here! Draw him over here! Alright, cool, I think they, uh, actually started ignoring me. Oh, you. You got nothing on me. You got nothing on me, you hear me, Minx? You hear me? Oh, lockdown. Okay, you got something on me now. Maybe, maybe we can try and save this one. This one's definitely a lost cause. 
And we'll see if this guy can help out at all. Good day, Commander. Yeah, get out of here, you stupid ghost. Oh, we're almost there. We're almost there. It's in the top right side. Battle cruisers were the way to go. All right, you guys ready for this? You guys ready for this? I sure am. Here we go. Charging your laser. I'm a fire in my laser coat. Boom. Tracking the Dominion flagship NORAD-3 in low orbit. Emperor Minx may be attempting an escape. Receiving incoming transmission. This is Emperor Minx of the Terran Dominion. I wish to parley with your executive officer at once. So, the elusive Arcturus Minx at last. I was hoping to speak with you before we finished our business here. I am Admiral Gerard Dugault. And I must commend you, sir, for holding back our advance for as long as you have. You are indeed a worthy opponent. My thanks to you, sir. But you must know that your victory here means little to me. It might have taken me a while, but I did overthrow the Confederacy. I'll overthrow your rule as well. That seems unlikely, sir. Seeing as how you will be publicly executed along with the rest of your ranking officers. You wouldn't dare. <laughs> the man who crowns himself emperor speaks to me of daring. You have far outlived your reputation as citizen Mengsk. Captain, prepare to take the emperor into custody. You'll have to postpone those plans, gentlemen. Sir, the rebel command ship Hyperion has just entered our sensor range. It is accompanied by a small Protoss fleet. What? Who are these intruders? Jim Rayner. What the hell are you doing here? I'm pulling your ass out of the fire, Arcturus. So shut up and sit tight. Make no mistake about it. We've got us a serious score to settle. But right now, a mutual acquaintance of ours wants you alive. Prepare your ships for dimensional recall. This is intolerable. They're escaping right out from under us. Track them. Track them. Oh my god, Jim Rayner. Oh, I forgot that he actually saved Minx. That is... That is awkward. Why do people trust Minx and why do people trust Kerrigan? You should never do that. Do you guys not watch The Walking Dead? You gotta be a man. You gotta be a man. Oh, man. What an awesome uh, plot twist that was. All right. I can't wait to get to the next mission. Hope you guys enjoy it and I'll see you guys next time. Hello everyone, this is HDSKSK here back some more Brood War campaign playthrough action. We're gonna continue right where we left off through Emperor's Flight. And, uh, UED flagship Alexander en route to the planet Ire. Oh yeah, they're gonna be pissed at the Protoss, huh? Captain, we have tracked the fugitives Minsk and Raynor to the devastated Protoss homeworld of Ire. Apparently, these two have taken shelter within a fortified Protoss encampment that lies at the base of a fully functional warp gate. I don't understand this. Why would the Protoss harbor these men? I have no idea, Gerard, but the Protoss aren't our only problem. Our sensors have identified multiple Zerg broods surrounding the Protoss base. Presently, the broods seem to be passive, but there's no telling what might set them off. Should the broods attack, we'd be hard-pressed to hold them at bay. I see. It is a risk we'll need to take. Minsk represents a considerable threat to our agenda and must be eliminated. Captain, you will focus your attack against the Rebel Command Center in the middle of the Protoss encampment. That must be where Mengsk and Raynor are hiding. We will deploy our own Valkyrie frigates and tighten up our air defenses. Vice Admiral Stu Koff and Lieutenant Duran will provide cover for your forces and ensure that no external threats interfere with your mission. Alrighty, let's do this, baby! Uh, apparently we're just flying around space killing everybody up in here. And, ooh, Valkyries. Valkyrie Gotta love the Valkyries. Oh, those Beatles do not stand a chance. They do not stand a chance one bit. 
But uh, let's be honest, Valkyries are pretty bad versus everything except for Beetalists. So you uh, you hardly ever see those. And I guess we just sit here and watch this as the reinforcements are slowly floating on in. Engineering Bay mixed in there. Siege tanks on the high ground, overpowered if you ask me. Oh, there we go, there we go. Gotta move this guy back though. All right, well, we're gonna have lots of uh, Valkyries, evidently. So that's, uh, that's a thing, and this should probably land over there. Let's, uh, let's go ahead and move these guys. It's not that important that I kill off the, uh, kill off the buildings here. All right, so you guys go there, you come up here. You guys go over there. All right, time to land. Time to land this bad boy. We actually have a, a very well-designed base here. And, oh, here's the SCVs. All right, so let's see. Let's get you guys mining first, and we'll start to wall this off. You can come up here. Starport can land back here, just because we don't really need that in the open. Same thing with this. One, two, okay, you can go there. You're coming up here, now we're gonna build gas right away to get this going. Now we have to build a lot of supply depots. So I gotta figure out where to build these. I guess, I guess we'll start building them down here. Hopefully none of my SCVs get stuck, which actually probably will happen just because they're so stupid. All right, so there's that. Get another SCV going. You are going to come down as well and build a depot. Unfortunately, depots do not fly, so that's just something we're going to have to live with here. All right, so these guys are all going. We got this, and let's see. I don't really need these guys for now, so you're just going to you're just going to float down here. I'm sure I'll use them later. You are going to go ahead and land right there. Actually, no. Let's uh, let's give myself a little bit more space. Let's put this. Let's uh, screw it. Let's go over here. We need all the space we can get. So you are going to go over here. You're going to go there and there. All right. So you come over here. Let's land right. Oh, that'll actually completely wall it in. That's kind of cool. All right. So you're going to come back here. That's going to be my little depot farm back there. All right, you guys get back to work. You two go into gas. Actually, let's get four in there just because. You come up Don't here. Don't give me baby. Don't give me baby. All right, so there's that. All right, I think we are okay. Now the mission is destroy Rainer's command center. So I think that's kind of what our mission was in the last game. This one looks like it's probably gonna take a little while. So I hope you guys are in it for the long haul. Because I, I mean, I'm stuck here. There's not a whole lot I can do about it. And we're going to go ahead and get... Oh, yeah, we have science vessels. Science vessels are awesome. And... All right, so there's that. And I kind of want to get seeds. Wait, I already have, have seeds. Do I have it researched? I guess so. I don't have to research it now, do I? Yes! All right, I can just make tanks from here on out. Tanks are pretty awesome. And you're going to go ahead and go up there. Got my depots nearly done, because they give you a lot of supply in you. Let's go ahead and scout over there. Just to see what we got. You come up here. Should be a good on supply for a little bit. The warp gate at the center of the Protoss encampment has been activated. Our sensors show that the gate's energies are inciting the Zerg to attack. Be prepared for anything, Captain. Oh, God. Oh, God. Not the Zerg. What is up here? Oh, dear. I'm assuming I have to kill that thing now. Oh, no. Uh-oh. Don't want to piss those off. I don't really have a whole lot of units, so... Definitely, definitely keep that in mind, units, while you're off running and charging at things. Oh, I see. I see the Zerg are attacking them. So that's even that's even better, I feel like. All right, I kind of want to repair these. We're going to spread them out. All right, you're going to start repairing. All right, there we go. Should be A-OK. -okay. You're at full health, so we're all good there. And there you are, so you're going over there. Just need as many SCVs as I can get for now. And I'll eventually probably need the add-on, so we'll just get that right away. Come over there. Should be good on supply for a little bit. And... Yeah, gonna repair these up. Even though they're not the most useful unit, it still is a unit that attacks air. I've seen air from the Protoss, so... Might as well, I guess. And I kind of probably should start walling it up here, maybe. Are right, you gonna go there? Build a bunker right there. That should help secure both of that. I want to make my base bigger than you would expect, because this is a, this is a tight little fit down here. Yeah, yeah. Okay, you go up there. So we should be pretty good on money here. Um, I, can all these mineral patches even be reached? I don't think this one can be reached. We, we have a lot of money in this area. That's something we should definitely remember. 
So the more SCVs we make, the better. Now what I'm wondering is if I should go mech or if I should go battle cruisers, because those are those are always pretty fun. Not gonna lie. Alright, we'll go ahead and build this down there. And I do need an armory at some point. So you your job is to build the armory. So you're gonna put that there. And I think this homie's stuck. There he is. Alright, get up there. Who needs to be repaired? You the last one? These two are the last ones. Transmit orders. Got my marines on. Kind of curious as to exactly what's up there. I do see a little bit of mineral patches. So that's that's definitely important. No, don't get stuck. Don't get stuck. You can do it. You can do it. Very nice. He actually managed to do it. All right, armories take a while. And man, we're gonna have so much gas. All right, so there's one, two. And actually. What I should do is try to take two of these guys. You guys are going in there for now. And let's build a turret just in case. Just in case they send some DTs or something at me. Which knowing my luck they would. Alright, so there's that. Now I have to decide do I want to go for air or do I want to go for mech? I feel like mech is the way to go. I'm going to start working on the upgrades actually. Alright, you come down here, you get in there. We got to unload and then come over here. Alright, all you guys should be okay. Time for some Goliaths with the range on the missiles. Alright, so you are going to unload there. Alright, so for now I don't think I need that anymore. And I can get the add-on so we can start using some fatty scans. And actually, I'm going to be super sneaky about this. I'm going to be super, super sneaky. All right, you, get, you gotta slowly come up here. All right, you're gonna be on the low ground, and we're gonna make more Goliaths because Goliaths are freaking awesome. You're gonna come up here and very sneakily, very sneakily siege right there. All right, let's see what they got. Oh, there's like nothing here. Okay, this should be an easy victory. And did I bring an SCV up here? Yes, I did. All right, so you, you are going to build a command center during this. We're also going to come up here. You're going to siege right here. Should put us in range. We're going to keep making Goliaths because they're awesome. And I guess we just uh, slowly work this down. We have the command center on the way. We can uh, we can take our time. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Those are goons are pissed. Get the defensive matrix. Should be enough to save that quite easily actually. And for those of you who don't know, Valkyrie do splash damage to air units only. They cannot attack uh, ground units. We should definitely build another supply depot. Hopefully that guy doesn't get stuck. If he does, then I've got a drop ship. All right, let's put this up here. Let's just get lots of glass now. Glass are very easy to use. There we go. Kill that Protoss scout. This means Valkyrie should be able to handle that. Although, God, they do so much damage. Uh-oh. Oh, uh, they're getting kind of mad that I'm taking their base. They're getting pretty upset about that. And I kind of want to build another armory, so we're going to put that there. And no, don't get stuck, don't get stuck. Yay, good job, you actually did it. You actually did it, I'm so proud of you. Oh man, these are good. Back up, back up, back up. Prepare this. Oh god, I need a defensive matrix. There we go. Repair it, repair it. Nice! Wow, that actually, uh, these guys are actually doing quite a bit of damage. Alright, so we need, let's do some tanks now. Oh man, they're still sending guys over here. They are very upset with me right now. Alright, we got that. Let's go ahead and grab all these guys. Go ahead and send them up here. Just make sure they're doing their fair share instead of just sitting around. Get another one of those. And let's just see what we got over here. More Zerglings. Oh, I gotta build a uh, science facility. Are you stuck in here? Alright, so you lift off, you come over here. You do the add on, and you make a tank. And we have to build another factory. So we're gonna put it right, run two, right there. More depots. Okay, that upgrade's already going. 
And just see what's over here. It looks like it's a base. All right, so let me see the uh, the mission objectives. All right, it's still just destroy his command center. So that's all we got to focus on. We don't got to focus on anything else. Go ahead, Tarkon. I'm eager to help. All right, so we're control one, control two, tank. We're gonna, we're gonna get a lot of tanks going and Goliaths. That factory's on the way. You just finish your job. You can lift off. Time to build another factory. You build a factory. There we go. There we go. I'll go ahead and do uh, do that there. We'll see. We'll see if I transition into that or not. I still feel like I should build that. Yeah, yeah, I know. I know, but we're getting our macro on. How about down here? Oh my God! There's so many bases. All right, so you're gonna rally up here. You're gonna get an add-on. I think you're actually stuck back here, so we gotta lift that off. Can't really build any more things down there. So we're gonna keep the depot farm going on over here. Come on, there you go. All right, we're doing, we're actually doing pretty good. Cause now we can start that upgrade. That one's halfway done. Still making SCVs. All right. Our economy is hopping right now. I'm just gonna keep the SCV production up because they give us a lot of mineral patches. And let's go ahead and do an add-on key fit through here. Please say yes. Okay, cool. All right, so there's that. I'm gonna build a turret there just because I can. Tank, tank. Let's even do another tank. Tanks are pretty good. All right, so there's that. This add-on's almost done, so that's even more tanks. I'm eventually going to run out of minerals. I know it's hard to believe now, or eventually run out of gas. There's that, and I kind of want to see, is there anything around here? Oh, there is something there, actually. All right, small base. I don't see any minerals, though. Good to know. You actually need to move a little bit. A little bit too. All right, you're going to go over here. A little bit more of an aggressive stance. You're going to come over here. Man, my SCVs have not gotten stuck like this whole time. They are killing it right now. All right, time for some Goliaths. And by some, I mean a freaking metric ton. Actually, wait, Goliaths probably way more than a ton, so. All right, upgrades. Yes. All right, I, I'm actually feeling pretty good about our macro this game. Not something I say very often when I'm playing StarCraft, but this almost seems, this almost seems not bad. Actually, let's, uh, let's just go over there. What's the worst that could happen? Aside from everything. All right, be careful, be careful. Let's, uh, let's just go ahead and siege up here just to be safe. Safety first. Especially versus Protoss, you want to go lots of siege tanks if you can. Or you guys can go ahead and hold position. Everyone really can just hold position. Well, we'll slowly take this out. Hey, Mutas are helping out. That's nice. It's quite nice of them to be, uh, to be that generous. I kind of need another factory, though. All right, so you guys are control three. As long as I have all the upgrades going, which I do, I could slowly begin making battle cruisers. Oh, you finally got stuck, didn't you? Whatever. Why are you guys come up here? I know, I need more depots. My, my depot guy got stuck. Let's get Volter upgrades just in case. All right, very nice. Looks like there's just a guy over here. Which, uh, hey, where'd those SCVs go? Did you guys make it over here? Where, where'd they go? Hello? Oh my god, it took them that long to get through there? Wow. All right, time for more depots. This is definitely depot time. All right, there we go, there's that. And I guess more Goliaths. I'm getting more Goliaths as I'm losing units, so I guess that's one way to do it. And you know what? We can even unload these guys. You guys are control group four. And all right, these are getting done. All right, cool. Even more Goliaths. Not enough depots yet. I want to be maxed out in just a minute. All right, there we go. All right, now the macro's rolling once again, so that's kind of nice. We're just gonna build a lot of Goliaths all at once. Yay, upgrades! All right, let's see. You guys need to go in normal mode. 
And I should probably hotkey this. Alright, let's see what they got over here. Uh, quite a bit of stuff, so I do have to be careful. Alright, four of you guys. Alright, you know what? You gotta lift off. You gotta land right there. Alright, now we're good on depots. So go mine down there. Glide, glide. And as long as we keep getting upgrades, I think we're gonna be okay. Oh god, what are you guys doing? Come here, back here, back here, back here, back here. Ooh, there you go, back it up. Okay, so they're only at plus one attack. Alright, you're control one. Control two. Control four. Alright, our macro is killing it now. We're, we're just gonna queue these up because I wanna focus on the battles. Alright. Let's do this. We are gonna figure this out. Can I actually kill this? No, that is uh, basically impervious to damage. All right, please guys, don't be stupid, okay? Can I trust you? Famous last words when trying to control a Terran army. All right, so you come over there. We got that. All right, siege mode. So many Goliaths though. That was a defiler, randomly out of nowhere. All right, you're gonna siege right here. Where do my tanks go? They're just chilling down here, of course. Where else would they be? All right, come on, kill the, kill the carrier. Don't worry about the interceptors. All right, more Goliaths. More Goliaths, just queue up all the Goliaths. You're making, making some vultures. All right, as long as we have detection up here, we're fine. All right, this could have, uh, this could have been a lot worse. Maybe, maybe not that much worse, but you know. At least we cleaned it out, I guess. All right, let's see. Well, that that regiment got completely crushed, so you, you're gonna go back up there. Actually, what I need to do is I need to set the rally point up here. Apparently, during all this, I cleaned out another base, so that's kind of nice. All right, more Goliaths. All you guys come up here. All you guys come up there. I feel like I really don't need more SCVs. Is there gas over here, though? Yeah, screw it. Let's take this expansion. You're going up there. There's that rally point. Okay, cool. I think we're... I think we are good to go. Okay, I can probably cancel like some of these hundreds of things I'm making. Alright, so there's that. All right, let's just uh, let's just keep pushing. Let's see what we end up with. Because so far these Protoss are not building a lot of stuff, so they're making my job easy, that's for sure. Goliath for the win, a move attack. You may not have multiple unit selection, but I can just build a million Goliaths and Vultures. You know what? Let's uh, let's siege these guys up. Just so we can. And let me see what we're dealing with up here. As long as they don't have siege tanks, that's really the only thing. Alright, Jim Rainer, I'm coming for ya! With a lot of vultures, apparently. And you guys keep going up there. Just keep on keeping on. Whichever, whichever route you guys think is best, just go for it. Just, just do it. Just do it. They do have a lot of stuff, which will uh, eventually catch up to me, but. Oh god, so kill a Sight Templar. Don't let him swarm you, because he totally will. Alright, you guys come up here. The siege tanks are awesome! God, I almost feel like I should make more factories. Keep going that way. What do you guys, where? What kind of freaking weird path are you guys taking? No! No, leave this guy alone! You guys need a siege on the high ground. Apparently they were going one way and now they all want to go this way, so whatever, I'll take it. Alright, more siege tanks this way. And go ahead and siege that. Uh oh. Oh, we got a unit jam up here. Unit jam, come on guys, get out of there. If only, oh, oh, we gotta save this guy. Save that tank down there. Alright, you guys come up here as well. 
Actually, this is going a lot better than I thought it would, to be honest. I mean, yes, we're losing some stuff, but overall... Overall, this is relatively easy. I wonder if this is actually the end or if I have to kill the Zerg bases, too. Oh, we got we got a unit jam again. Too many, too many units, not enough space. Come on, you guys can fit. I know you can. I know you can do it. You can do it. I have faith. I have faith. Hey. Hey, that's not cool. That's not cool. Alright, this Goliath's gonna go draw the fire. Wait, they're going somewhere else, so. I will take it. Alright, looks like uh looks like we'll be able to kill off his command center right here. Is that actually gonna be the end? That was that was surprisingly easy. I feel like the last mission was actually harder. But then again, there was like battle cruisers and stuff. Good work, Captain. The command center is destroyed, but it looks like Minx and Reynard will try to escape through the warp gate. Make ready to move in and intercept their vessel before. Wait, I just picked up multiple Zerg signals coming in from the northeast. That's Duran's position, but he seems to have moved his forces out of place. Lieutenant Duran, this is Stukov. Come in. I'm tracking a massive Zerg swarm in your quadrant. Respond, damn it! That is strange, Vice Admiral. My scanners don't show any Zerg at all. Maybe you have a technical problem with your equipment. Lieutenant, if these Zerg get through, we'll never be able to capture Minsk. I'm giving you a direct order to return to your position and reinforce my troops. Oh, I'm sorry, sir, but it seems your signal's fading out. I couldn't make out that last part. I'll try to re-establish contact later. Duran! Captain, your position will be overrun by superior Zerg numbers within 15 minutes. I suggest you retreat back to the fleet immediately. Inform Admiral Dugal that I... All right, are we are we still playing or is that? Oh God! Uh, well, thankfully I have a lot of Goliaths, but uh, am I supposed to like, am I supposed to keep fighting or what is what is this about? Your forces are under attack. And they escaped. And they escaped. And that poor Archon, he's like, all right, guys, let's go, guys, guys. All right, so uh, they managed to escape. And Duran is being a jerk, so never trust uh, Duran. Never trust Kerrigan. Those are the rules of StarCraft, okay? From here on out, no one is to trust Kerrigan, and no one is to trust Duran. If anyone does, you're fired, okay? That, that's what it's going to take. Whatever. I hope you guys enjoy it, and I'll see you guys next time. Stupid Duran. <laughs> The fugitives Minx and Raynor escaped through the warp gate due to the intervention of the Zerg. But shortly before our forces were overrun, Vice Admiral Stukov took control of a large contingent of troops and came here to the planet Braxis. Why would he abandon the Battle of Iron? Why has he come back to Braxis? I mean no offense, Admiral, but perhaps Stukov's loyalties are not as strong as you once believed. Because you are young and foolish, Lieutenant, I will pardon that insult. Alexei and I have been friends since long before you were born. However, he must be found. If Stukov is here, he will account for his actions. Admiral, our sensors have detected a fully functional side disruptor on the planet's surface directly below our position. It would appear that the Vice Admiral did not destroy the side disruptor on Tarsonis as was ordered. What? Impossible! I warned you, Admiral, Stukov has betrayed you! He's reconstructed the side disruptor in order to sabotage your mission in the sector. I can't believe it. Yet, the evidence is incontrovertible. Alexei, what have you done? Perhaps you've been right all along, Lieutenant. On my authority, enter the side disruptor and deal with the Vice Admiral appropriately. Of course, Admiral. Unauthorized entry detected. Query in. This room's clear. Attack. Quality of service. I'll take care of it. Right away. 
Of course. You got it. What do you need? Right away. Hey guys, it's Husky here and I'm playing the Patriot's Blood mission from the Terran campaign in Brood War. This mission takes place inside a space station that's been overrun by the Zerg, and my mission is to rescue a group of civilians who are trapped inside. Unlike most missions, I don't have a base to start with and I'm only equipped with a handful of marines and medics. My strategy for this mission is to be as efficient as possible with my limited resources. I'm using my marines to take out any Zerg units that I encounter, while my medics keep them healed up. I'm also using my science vessel to detect any cloaked units that might be lurking around. Since I don't have a base to build from, I need to be very careful with my units. I can't afford to lose any of them, or I'll be severely weakened for the rest of the mission. I'm being very methodical in my approach, making sure to clear out each room before moving on to the next one. The Zerg are throwing everything they've got at me, including Zerglings, Hydralisks, and Mutalisks. It's a constant battle, but I'm managing to hold them off so far. I'm using the environment to my advantage, using doors and corners to funnel the Zerg into choke points where I can take them out more easily. As I progress through the mission, I'm constantly keeping an eye out for any civilians who might be in need of rescue. I'm also picking up any resources or weapons that I come across, as they'll be crucial for my survival. Overall, this mission is a real test of my skills as a StarCraft player. Without a base to fall back on, I need to rely on my wits and quick reflexes to take out the Zerg and rescue the civilians. But I'm confident that with my marines and medics, I can make it through this mission and come out victorious. Alright, now that that 100% accurate commentary is done, now I'm going to tell you the top 10 reasons Zerg are overpowered. Something I think we can all agree on. 1. Fast and Agile Units Zerg units are some of the fastest and most maneuverable in the game, making them great for hit and run tactics and scouting. 2. Quick Production Zerg buildings and units can be produced very quickly, allowing for rapid expansion and the ability to quickly respond to enemy attacks. 3. Resource Efficiency Zerg units and buildings require fewer resources than their Terran or Protoss counterparts, allowing for more units to be produced and a larger army to be fielded. 4. Superior Mobility With the ability to create units that can burrow, fly, or move quickly across the map, Zerg has a significant advantage in terms of mobility over other races. 5. Powerful Spells and Abilities Zerg units have a variety of powerful spells and abilities that can be used to devastating effect. How can I be of service? Such as the Infestor's Fungal Growth or the Queen Spawn Larva 6, Adaptability, Zerg has the ability to adapt to different situations and enemy compositions thanks to their ability to morph their units into different forms. 7. Strong Economy With the ability to produce multiple drones from a single larva, Zerg can quickly establish a strong economy and outproduce their opponents. 8. Swarm Mentality Zerg units are designed to be used in large numbers and work together to overwhelm the enemy, making them a formidable force in battle. 9. Stealth and Surprise Zerg has the ability to create units that are invisible or have the ability to burrow, allowing for surprise attacks and ambushes. 10. Unique Playstyle Zerg has a unique playstyle that requires players to constantly adapt and be on the offensive, making them a challenging and rewarding race to play. Okay, now that we all agree Zerg is overpowered, let's talk about 10 reasons Terran are overpowered. 1. Strong defensive capabilities. Terran units are equipped with powerful defensive structures like bunkers, planetary fortresses, and missile turrets that can hold off enemy attacks. 2. Versatile units. Terran units are versatile and can be used in a variety of roles, from long-range siege units to fast-moving raiders. Yes, Captain. How can I be of service? What do you need? Vice Admiral Stukov. I am here under orders to terminate your command. Lieutenant Duran, I'm not surprised. We both know exactly what it is that you're here to terminate. Get on with it. Say goodnight, Stukov. To hell with you. <gasps> Lieutenant Duran, report your situation immediately. Gerard, old friend, you do indeed have a traitor in your midst, but it's 
not me. Duran. He has been playing us both from the start. He convinced you to destroy this side disruptor, even though it was our best chance at defeating the Zerg. And then on Meyer, he allowed the Zerg to overrun us even as we had the fugitives in our grasp. I came here to activate the one hope we have of defeating them. And you killed me for it. Duran is your enemy, Gerard. I suspect that he may even be infested as well. Use the disruptor, Gerard. Finish our operation. Let my death have at least some meaning. Alexei! Oh, what have I done? What have I done? Computer, where the hell is Lieutenant Duran? The Lieutenant no longer registers on my sensors, Admiral. He appears to have vanished. No. Self-destruct sequence initiated. Sir, the disruptor's power core has just been set to overload. In order to prevent meltdown, you will need to reach the manual override terminal and shut the reactor core down. It must have been Joran. You men serve the Vice Admiral loyally. I ask that you continue to serve his memory by keeping this disruptor in one piece. Now get going and find an override terminal. Systems functioning. Confirmed. Security cameras activated. Orders received. Calling on my heart for duty. Three, strong production capabilities, Terran buildings can produce multiple units at once, allowing for rapid army expansion and production. Four, mobile detection, Terran has access to mobile detection units like the Raven and the Science Vessel, allowing them to detect and destroy cloaked or burrowed enemy units. Five, drop play, Terran can use their medevacs to drop units behind enemy lines, causing chaos and disruption in the enemy base. 6. Tactical Nukes – Terran has access to the powerful Ghost Unit, which can launch tactical nukes that deal massive damage to enemy structures and units. 7. Strong Economy – Terran has access to the Mule, a unit that can be summoned to mine minerals at an accelerated rate, giving them a strong economic advantage. 8. Repairability – Terran units and structures can be repaired by SCVs, allowing them to quickly recover from damage taken in battle. 9. Stim Pack Ability. Terran infantry units can use stim packs to greatly increase their attack speed and movement speed, making them a powerful force in battle. 10. Strong Air Units. Terran has a variety of strong air units, like the Viking and the Battle Cruiser, that can dominate the skies and provide valuable air support to ground forces. Overall, Terran is a strong and versatile race in StarCraft, with a variety of strengths and advantages that make them a popular choice among players. That leaves us Protoss, the most underpowered, and most beloved, race in StarCraft II. Here are 7 reasons Protoss are underpowered. 1. High resource cost, Protoss units and structures are generally more expensive to produce than those of other races, making it harder for Protoss players to expand their economy and build up their army quickly. 2. Weak early game, Protoss units tend to be weaker in the early game, leaving them vulnerable to aggressive early game rushes from other races. 3. Limited mobility, Protoss units tend to be slower and less mobile than those of other races, making it harder for them to move around the map and respond quickly to enemy attacks. 4. Fragile units, Protoss units tend to have lower health and armor than those of other races, making them easier to take down in battle. Percent limited anti-air options, Protoss players may struggle to deal with air units in the early game, as their main anti-air unit, the Stalker, requires a lot of resources to produce. 6. Lack of production options, Protoss buildings can only produce one unit at a time, making it harder for Protoss players to build up their army quickly. 7. Weak late game, Protoss units tend to be weaker in the late game, making it harder for them to compete with the powerful late game units of other races.
Sequence initiated. Good work, Captain. I want this Psy Disruptor kept on full power around the clock. I leave a garrison here to protect it as well. Prepare the fleet to move out. We are going to the planet Char to claim that cursed Lorahai. Did they have an El Duran for what he has done this day? Hello everyone, this is HTSKS Gearbox, some more Brood War campaign playthrough action. As you can tell, my uh, microphone is actually on this time. My apologies about the last game. Now we're on the mission to chain the beast. UED flagship Alexander low orbit over the planet Char. Captain, with the Psy Disruptor's signal hampering the Zerg's communications to one another, the swarms over Char have scattered in disarray, allowing the fleet to penetrate to the planet's surface. However, there is still a considerable number of defenders nestled around the fledgling Overmind. Alexei was right. The Disruptor is the key to victory here. If I had destroyed the machine, as Duran suggested, we would never have made it this far. Nevertheless, the time is upon us, Captain, to do what we came here for. We will claim the Overmind in the name of humanity. Be advised, Captain. Our sensors have identified three cerebrates who constitute the core of the Overmind's defenses. Each cerebrate's distinct capabilities are still unknown, so proceed with extreme caution. Launch your forces, and let not a Zerg survive. Once you have reached the Overmind and crushed its defenders, you are to send in specially trained medics who will pacify the creature with potent neurostim drugs. 
Only then will our victory be assured. And Captain, remember that Duran is still out there somewhere. I'd venture a guess that his treachery has only just begun. Be careful, and good luck. I am sure that this will be our finest hour. Alright, I remember this mission taking quite some time, so I hope you guys have your popcorn ready. I hope that uh, you are pretty much ready. Oh, no, hey, I gotta get my macro on, okay? Alright, what do we got? Alright, we'll go ahead and uh, sacrifice those bunkers. You guys, for now, can just hang out right there. And uh, anyways, I do remember this mission takes a long, long time. So just uh, just remember that, guys. Hope you are. Hope you're getting nice and comfy. I do apologize about last time. How uh, basically, well, we guys kind of know what happened. But uh, anyways, you know what I should actually do? Let's go ahead and lift this off. Put that over there. We're gonna lift you off. Put you over here. Don't worry, don't worry. My master plan. I have I have a plan. Actually, I want to try something as well. Let's see, can I take that expansion right away, or how exactly... I don't remember how this mission works. I do remember that there's something very terrifying about this level. And, uh, you know what? Let's go ahead and do that. Let's let's just try. Let's see if we can actually do this. I don't know if this is going to be overextending myself or not. It probably is. In fact, it most certainly is. Alright, so let's go ahead and build some marines. I should definitely get a factory going. We're actually going to put the factory right there. Oh god, what's attacking me? Something's attacking me. I heard my missile turrets. Okay, so... Yep, this mission is definitely going to take a while. Hope you guys are ready. We're going to spread out these guys a little bit. In case they send anything down there. And for now, just make lots and lots of SCVs. I should probably actually even just start making depots as well. Because God knows I'm going to need them. What, what's happening? What's happening? Oh god. Where are my units at? There they are. Alright, we're okay. We're okay. We're doing just fine. Everything is okay. Oh god, no it's not. No it's not, not the SCVs. Anything but the SCVs. They're attacking me from all sorts of different angles. Thankfully I do have medics. Which makes this a lot easier. Alright, so there's that. I should definitely get upgrades though. Because I'm going to be using a lot of bunkers. Alright, more, more of these. More of those. Let's get our add-on going. Yeah, right there, I suppose. And you are going to build another barracks. That is what I need right about now. Alright, so there's that. You need to build another barracks. Oh, that's going to trap those units, huh? I'm trying to make a fancy wall in here. It's just not working. Alright, so we'll put bunkers up there later. We're going to put that there. Rally points there. Alright, so this command center should be done, yes? Alright, so you lift off. I want to try and get this extra income as quickly as possible. Hopefully that's not a mistake. We'll see. We shall see. Okay, so I think for now I need a bunker right here. And that choke point. I need to work on siege mode. God, I need more money. I need more money right now. I need more money to pay the bills. All right, let's see if this SCV can actually get up there. And we'll begin making SCVs over here. You're doing good. Definitely need some more Marines off of this. This is almost done. All right, so you're gonna come up here and build a bunker. Actually, I wonder if I build a supply depot here. Yeah, let's put that depot there. More Marines, let's just set the rally point down there. Okay, so now that this bunker's done, you guys go get in there. All right, all right, our economy's going good, ish. I at least have this other expansion going now. All right, you guys load up in there. Oh, come on, not a medic. Really? Okay, so there's that. And then we got my hit squad over here. We got the engineering bay going. Good, good. Let's go ahead and build another factory. And hopefully, hopefully my Marines can actually make it through here. All right, so you need to build that. You also need to build that. Oh my god, I need more money. I need more money so badly. All right, down goes the bunker right there. Oh god, I'm being attacked by something. Where is it? Where is it? Send him down here. No, not the depots. Anything but the depots. All right, we gotta build another depot, I guess. No, medics, why aren't you healing? You had one job! 
You had one job. Where's the other medic? Oh god. Oh god, is that actually in the red? That's gonna be in the red, isn't it? Oh no, barely not in the red. Oh my god, what are their upgrades at? They're already at one one. That that kind of explains some of what's going on here. All right, so there's that, and let's see, build another depot right here. Yeah, yeah, let's work on that and the armory. We got we got to slowly wall ourselves in. I do not trust. Okay, once once I get the tanks rolling, I think we're gonna be okay. I think it's gonna be okay. Come on, give me some more of that. All right, so you're over there. My my group is looking a lot smaller than it used to. There's that, and you guys gonna come up here and there. And I wonder, actually, I guess you should build that. Go ahead and repair that depot. All right, as soon as we get tanks, that's uh, that's gonna be my saving grace, hopefully. All right, so we've got one siege tank, so you can just sit right here. Here's my hit squad. More tanks. They definitely they definitely make this level tough because uh, they do not give you a lot to start with. All right, so you guys should probably just get back to work. We're good on depots. We got that going. Uh, let's put a bunker right here. All right, you're going to go ahead and start mining. And you start mining. Okay, we're, we're just going to focus on SCBs and defensive buildings and units. All right, so you're going to be... Actually, that's not a very good place for you. How about right here? All right, I think you need to come down here. And you go over there. This is this is pretty frantic having to control two major bases like this, but I think we can do it. Alright, so you guys go in there. We need another engineering bay. Yes, kill the overlord. Oh god. Come over here. No, no, my tanks aren't in the way. Are in range. There we go. Back him up over here. Come on, Siege Tank, you can do it. Definitely need some more marines. And some more tanks. I found a very obvious weakness in my defenses. All right, so you're gonna repair that. More SCBs. Let's actually let's actually build more depots over here. Okay, so I think I need an academy really badly. So you're going to be right there. Whew, okay, this mission is tough, but we're we're tougher, right? Right, guys? Anybody? Yeah, tanks to you. Actually, can you fit up here? Probably not. Oh, you totally can. You're going right there. You are going to be right here. And you need to just keep making workers. Okay. I think we finally got our income going correctly. As long as we have these guys. I almost have the academy. Okay, I'm feeling, I'm feeling okay now. I'm feeling kind of okay. Can you keep the worker count rolling? Should probably get some gas now. Okay, so you guys, should probably use you over here. Can I build a turret right here? No. I can right there though. So that's gonna go there. Definitely need marine range. Oh my god, do I need that. Okay. We got units. We got workers. We got siege tanks. I'm feeling pretty good about this. I don't know about you guys. Are you guys going there? Wait, are you guys just chilling there? Probably. But I thought I was building supply depots. Let's uh, let's see what's over here. Make sure there's no hidden base or anything. And oh oh, what's back here? Looks like nothing. All right, I guess I need more depots, though. Screw it, I'm gonna hide a depot back here. The computer shall never find it. All right, so siege mode. I guess since you're trapped, you might as well just siege up there anyway. And I should probably build more armories. Just gonna put that there. Yeah, siege up right there. I don't like this that's going on. This is nice and wide open. Not sure how I feel about that. Yes, upgrades are complete. What is my depot done? All right, we're gonna we're gonna keep hiding these. Yes. All right, Marines, tanks, and I need a starport as well. All right, so you go over there. Okay, 
Now we're good. We finally got our economy rolling. So what that means is it's time for production. All right, so we're going to do that. One there. Even one there. Homie's done. Nope, don't get stuck. Don't get stuck. All right, go there. Since, since we're all stuck anyways, might as well uh, just siege up. And one, two, three. We're going to put that there. Oh, I think I misclicked. Oh, God. Oh, God. What is that? What is that? No, I need more depots. All right, when you guys are done, are done you got to come over here. All right, homie's almost done with this. Come on, don't get stuck. Don't get stuck. You can do it. You can do it. You can do it. Yes! And, well, hopefully that thing doesn't go to this base over here because uh, that's going to be pretty bad for me. All right, so we're going to siege up right there. You and you. All right, time to get these add-ons, baby. We've just had a whole cargo ship full of whoop-ass dumped on us. We ran into a new strain of Ultralisk, and it took a lot of pepper to bring it down. To top it all off, our recon squad reports that the critter's been reincarnated by a nearby Cerebrid, and it's on its way back for more. Order scout? All right, so I think we dealt with that quite easily. This guy's still just building the hidden supply depot farm down here. But uh, you guys, you guys definitely have a very obvious mission to me. And that is to build all of the depots right here. Wait, where's this happening? You're not in the red, are you? All right, as long as, as long as nothing's in the red over here. Oh, yes, it is time for some Goliaths. I'm going to go ahead and get the, uh, the vulture speed as well. All right, we should be, we should be good on supply depots for a while. What? Where? Oh, is it that stupid spine crawler? Or sunken colony, rather? Okay, so I think right now, in order to kill these, I have to... Maybe I should switch to some air units, although I definitely got a lot of mech buildings, so... Let's, uh, let's even get the spider mines just to have them. And, oh, you need to come right there. And we should be nearly maxed out. SCVs, how you doing? You can come up there. I think we're fully saturated there. This is looking pretty good. Okay, so to kill this, I have to kill this base right here. Oh, God. Oh, God, here it comes. Get the add-ons going so I can scan, see what's what's over yonder. And I should probably get one SCV to begin repairing these, so go ahead and do that. And upgrades. I need to do upgrades. So there's that. And I need a science facility, which means I need a starport. Uh, okay, so we got all these, and I think what I might need to do is, do I have to kill them with air? Oh my god, how much is over there? Alright, your control died. Alright, so, I definitely need to do drops. Oh no, he's attacking over here! This is not good. This is not good. This is not what I want to have happen. Oh my god, you guys, you gotta get, you gotta get out of here. Oh, they can't get out of here, can they? Oh, the humanity! SCV, get out of there! Get out of there! Draw them away! Draw them away! Yes, oh god. Alright, can you guys come up here? Maybe? Oh god. Oh, this is not good. No, come up here. Come up there. Oh, this is putting a wrench into my whole plan! This is putting a wrench into my whole plan! Oh god, at least he doesn't do splash damage, right? All right, you guys can get down this way, right? So if I tell you to go there, you'll actually do it. Okay. All right, we, we can safely escape for now. Unfortunately, let's see, is this in the red? No, we're gonna repair this anyways. Come on, let me scan. Okay, we definitely need some dropships going on. And uh, I guess this control group. Also this siege tank. All right, you guys need to repair this like crazy. Repair it, repair it. Repair it. Don't let him kill it. There we go. There we go. Yeah, not so bad after all, are you? Oh god. Oh god, with the repair. There we go. Woo! Alright, you guys need to come over here again. Probably a lot of you guys should go over here. And you know what should also go over there? Some of these guys. That's all I'm gonna say. 
All right, so Science Silly's done, so I can begin researching this finally. Which means you, are you trapped? Or can you make another engineering bay? Yes, sir. Right, you need to go repair that. State the nature of your yeah, you guys purchase. come over here. Even even bring the medic, see if I care. On my way. All right, so there's that. Maybe even build a bunker. Where does it hurt? Maybe even send these guys and the siege tanks. Where are you guys at? All right, so you're gonna come down here. Because turns out uh, they like killing that off, so. Who would have thought? All right, so you guys go there. Let's get four, just to make sure we have all of it. And I'm just gonna be scanning around. So I think what I have to do is drop up here, try and kill off that base. It's gotta be tough, but we can do it. And we have lots of money for vultures, so screw it. Lots of marines. I think I just need one more depot, which I can probably just build down here. Where does it hurt? You guys ever make it over here safely? Alright, siege tanks come over there. Who's under attack? Stim pack. Upgrades. Basically, upgrades are kind of the are the important thing right now. Also, apparently vultures, because I have lots of money, so might as well. Alright, should be able to deal with that easily enough. And this upgrade I need. Oh god, here they come. All right, so we need to build another, no wait, let's build the depot here. Now let's build it there. You also build a depot over here. And where are my siege tanks? Here they are. Here they are. Hopefully we get the tanks over there in time. Oh God, is he here already? Okay, we're at least dealing with this. Okay, did we kill the uh, did we kill the big bad guy yet? I sure hope so. Okay, so drop ships over here. Gotta have so many vultures right now. All right, so let's go with uh, these guys. Oh, here he is. Here he is. Kill it. Kill it. Kill it! God, it does so much damage! Oh my god, I killed that tank too, are you serious? Alright, you guys come over here, I have an idea. Screw it, just, just plant the mines, I don't even care. I don't even care, at this point you guys are just mines. That's all you are to me. Alright, this should actually help out quite a bit, I hope. Alright, so we got this medevac, this medevac. Apparently I only made one Goliath, so... You want a piece of me, boy? There's that. All right, you guys are gonna go ahead and move out. Hopefully, you make it safely to here. Can I take your order? As soon as I can kill, ooh, oh, we got two more of these guys. All right, you are going to unload here. Is anything under attack that I can't deal with? All right, there's that. Apparently, this depot never finished, but whatever. That upgrade's good. You're on the way. God, it costs so much. What are you guys doing? Don't you even think about it. Alright, we're slowly working this down. Finally, we're on the offense for like the first time so far. I think actually if I come up here... Should be okay. Alright, lots of stuff over Oh god, where are you going, Goliath? Why would you do such a thing? All right, let's get let's get Goliaths in here. Then I can sacrifice these vultures. All right, this should actually be perfect. All right, so you're coming down here. Oh god, not a torture core. It no no normal mode. Anything but a tortured roar. All right, let's even get some vultures in here, man. All right, who's not who's not full? Okay, you guys come up here and unload. Okay, that's over there. I wonder. I'll take this guy with me and this one. Okay, you guys come up here. Let's just get lots of Goliaths, lots of upgrades. Wait, wait, no, cancel these. Need more upgrades. It's all about the upgrades right now, especially since I'm maxed out. Come on, come on, come on! Give me the upgrade. Okay, here we go, here we go. 
Can I actually get range up here? Let's find out. Why you guys come up here? Alright, let's hope the siege tank can be in range. Please be in range. No! No! It's gonna kill me, isn't it? Gosh darn it. Alright, let's see. No, kill this! What are you doing? Oh, that's right. The thing is right there. Alright, hang on. Load these guys up. I have a plan. Go ahead, Okay, here we go. Here we go. Here's my plan. They're covered by the tanks. You can do this. You can do this. We must kill it. Kill it now. Kill the stupid cerebrate. Kill it. Oh my god, this is a die. I'm going to be so sad. Oh, I don't think it's going to. I don't think it's going to. Nope. It is worth a shot. All right, let's see. Splash is still alive, but the splash damage, of course, kills him off. All right, let's try. Let's try two vultures. Oh God, what are you doing? Why are they not? What are my siege tanks doing? Oh, you gotta, you gotta move. All right, you're gonna come up here. You can do it. You can do it. Apparently, no, they can't. Okay, we need all my dropships. Where are they at? Where are my dropships at? We can do this. Okay, we have three up here. There we go, okay. Woo! We can do this the right way. Alright, so that's where they go. Plus I have to kill this guy over here. Which he is the ultralisk guy, so if we kill that, then there's no more ultralisk. Alright, let's go for crazy mech timing. What, did this never start? Gosh darn it. Right, let's even get some vultures in here. All right, you're full. Right, let's get the marines instead. Vultures going there. All right. If this drop's not enough, I'm gonna be really bummed out about it. Destination. More and more Goliaths. I should probably build a command center somewhere, but. Nope. Nope. Get over here. Over here. Protected by the tank. Protected by the tank-ish. I feel like so far the tank's doing more damage than good, but whatever. There we go, that should kill it off. Yes! Yes! Oh my god, it kills their whole base, so as long as you kill the Cerebrate. As long as you kill the Cerebrate. Alright, let's see what we got. Ooh, you know what I can do. You guys know what I can do? Because I know what I can do. Alright, we are going to figure this out. We are going. Oh god, kill that stupid thing. Yes, kill off all these stupid buildings. And I should be able to send over an SCV now. Please tell me they have a gas. They do. Alright, upgrades are fully done, so we gotta start working on air upgrades. And also, we need to start working on air units in general. But something is not in the way. It's all in your head. Oh my god, something is here. Whatever. Yeah, let me see if there's actually something here. That was weird. Alright, let's get cloaking. This is how we're gonna do this one, man. This is what it's come to. Alright, we're just gonna go ahead and start building the command center wherever. I kinda wanna start cleaning out all these stupid buildings. Until we hit some of the other guys. Alright, so those should be fully upgraded. And I should probably get rid of some of these. Uh... No! No! Don't do it! Don't do it! Guardians are freaking annoying! There we go, we should be able to kill it. Yes! Alright, let's send everything I have over into one space. Alright, so all you guys go that way. Apparently you guys are working on those, that's fine. And... Get the Wraith action going. Oh god, Tortured Roar. Tortured Roar, not good. Alright, so unfortunately we're probably going to intercept it with these guys. But let's just, let's just go with these, see what happens. Because I need to free up some supply anyway. Go ahead, HQ. 
And you three here. You guys are still working on that. Take your time. Hey, here's at least some stuff to kill. So that's not bad. Ah, infested Terrans, I see. Oh, he's got plague me, isn't he? No, Dark Swarm. Watch out, watch out, watch out, watch out. Oh, God. That Dark Swarm was really good. That Dark Swarm was really good. All right, you know, for now, let's just hold position down here. Let's just, uh, let's just hold here. Oh, are you kidding me? Are you freaking kidding me? Oh man, it's gotta suck to be these vultures. Quick, quick, drop spider mines. Drop all the spider mines. Yeah, go, go spider mines, man. That's the way to do it. Eat it! Eat it! Oh god, spider mines are so good. Yeah, not so fancy now, are ya? Not so fancy now, are ya? Killed by Goliath. All right, let's just uh, actually no, let's keep making let's keep making rates. Oh my god, all you guys seriously don't have anything to do. All right, you go mine up here. Oh, I don't need more. I don't need more SCBs. That's for sure. All right, all you guys, you have a new home. Destination. And let's see, maybe you can come over here and help protect it. All right, rates are really bad, but I want to try this. I just want to try this. Go ahead, I'm even man. giving them the energy upgrade. That's uh, that's how much I love them right now. All right, so we have plenty of minerals. That's for sure. Channel open. Oh, there's a lot of guys up here still. All right, so here's this, and I want to see. If I scan around. I switch over here. I think I can go around these. Okay, we're gonna we're gonna try this. No guarantees, but we'll see. Definitely need more upgrades. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. There we go. All right, so this needs to be a gas geyser immediately. This should have... Ah, it's missing one worker. I should just put two in there just to be safe. At this point, I really only need gas, so... And I think that that's going to be pretty darn good. So we'll come down here. All right. So I think I think this will work. I sure hope so. Anyways. All right. Here we go. We are going in. We are going in. Oh god. Nope. Nope. Down here. Oh god. Oh god. They've got so many. Oh, that's so much damage! Split up! Split up! You can do it! You can do it! Get out of there! Oh, he does so much damage! He does so much damage! Kill it! Alright, maybe I can actually work on... Where's my science facility? This mission is so hard, man. This is definitely like the hardest mission in the game. Alright, so there's that. Let's get uh, these rolling. We have to have a fancy backup plan. All right, so you guys all go in there. I don't even care if it's overkill. I just need to make sure we are fully saturated. All right, so let me see. I think this is the next safe spot. Go ahead, command. Should be okay. Roger. All right, all right. I'm just hoping they don't have a lot of burrowed units up here, which they probably do. Go ahead, command. Transmit cord. All right, all my add-ons are complete, so that's nice. Oh, oh, kill this. You're all going to have to kill this regardless. Okay, so you go over there. Oh, God. Kill this. Kill it. No. No. All right, we got to wait for that. All right, so we have lots of money now. We're working on good upgrades. Time for some battle cruisers. And let's see. Let's scan over here, see what they got. All right, I think I can do this. There are a couple Hydras, but other than that, all right, here we go. You guys ready for this? Here we go, we gotta kill the Overlords first. Oh God, oh God, they have lots of detection. Just kill it, oh, it's not working, retreat, retreat. I didn't see that score crawler. 
All right, well, we're down to this mini, so I guess we can kill this off. Oh, God, this is not going to work. This is not going to work. I made a huge mistake. All right, I guess we can try and kill these air units. But other than that, that was a absolutely catastrophic failure. Go ahead, attack on. And let's see, how can I kill that freaking thing? I did, I mean, I did some damage, but. Oh my god, I only have one wraith left. Are you serious? Attack formation. Well, maybe I can attack this. Maybe I can be super sneaky. Aha! Your sunken colony is not so strong now. Oh, guys, he's gonna drop units up here, isn't he? Yep. All right, all right, you win. You win. All right, here's the battle cruisers. Insufficient Vespine gas. All right, let's see. So, shoot. <laughs> all right, all right, we. Can, oh God, battle cruisers! I need you now more than ever. Oh, he actually killed my add-on. So uncool. I wonder if there's another base somewhere. Ooh, there's something up here. I don't see any gas, though, unfortunately. Destination. What do you want? All right, Volchi, go scout it out. Confirm. What do you want? Let's see if they have any gas over here. I don't think that they do, unfortunately. All right, can we get up here? All right. We are staying focused. Oh god. Oh, this is so much, so much badness going on right now. Definitely need to back out of there. Because if any zergling show up, it is game over. All right, we're killing some stuff down here. Not bad. We are working our way up. Oh no, we are not. No, we are not. All right, so I should probably do this upgrade first. Insufficient Vespine gas. Yeah. And I guess we'll kill that off. My God, they have a lot of stuff. Operational. Take it slow. Take it slow. Receiving transmission. Let's see. That's like an island, it looks like. But they do have gas. Battle cruiser operational. All right, so we got all the battle cruisers going. Quite a few, actually. Insufficient Vespine gas. That upgrade shouldn't take too long. Let's just while we wait, take go ahead and kill slow. off some of this stuff so it doesn't throw us off later. Frequencies open. Oh god, not another tortured roar. Where is he even going to go this time? Or do I even want to know? All right, you guys go kill that. Body cannon up for the energy upgrades and stuff. Good day, Commander. Definitely need the upgrades for these guys. Don't want to be losing those. Maybe going mech was the better option. Definitely, definitely that raid strategy did not work. That's for sure. All right, we are almost mined out down here. Come on, come over here. Come over there. I'm gonna take that out. You can be control eight. I'm just scanning everywhere to see if I can find a new home. All right, nothing up there. Still nothing up there. Yes, kill it! Kill it! Yes, I have my new strategy. There we go. All right, kill these fools. Oh, God! Oh, that's so many! Why do they have so many? Oh, God, there's more. Oh, it never ends. Oh, there's so many units! No! Why are there so many? Oh god, even a Hydralisk is getting mixed in. Oh my god. Oh my god. I thought this was going to be a long mission, but jeez. Oh god, don't lose this one. Well, we lost it. Are you seriously not going to be able to kill these? Are you 100% serious right now? Wait, you should probably kill the Hydra, huh? Come on. Kill the Hydra, you can do it. All right, let's see. Kill this one. I can't even, I can't even escape this. They're making units way too fast. Oh, bother. Oh, bother. All right, uh, should I switch it up back to mech, I guess? 
Because that did not work at all. All right, that's what we're doing. We are we are doing all mech, and we are going to do this legit. We are going to do this so legit. We're even going to get Marines. All right. I'm pissed now. They have upset me on a deep, deep level. Oh, my God. Are they seriously going to attack this base? You're not going to attack that base, are you? Okay, good. Wait, I have no anti-air now. I have, like, no anti-air. Um, well, this isn't good. I do have these Marines, though. And this one Goliath. So let's go find him. Go, go, Goliath. You got this. This is all you. There we go. We totally got it. We totally got it. Alright, time for some of those. You know what? I just gotta throw these away. I don't need these anymore. I need the supply much more than I need those. Okay, I don't need this guy. Really, I don't need these guys. I'll leave a couple for mining, but let's just sacrifice some of these. Because we need everybody involved. Yes, we do. Now, yeah, they have plus three armor. They're plus two. They, uh, they survive for quite some time. All right, let's see. I could definitely... See, I really don't think that we can, though. That's the problem. All right. This is this is it. This is gonna be it. We definitely need more Goliaths, though. We are bringing everybody along for the ride. Come on, everybody. You are all joining in. All right, now I'm pissed. Now I'm super pissed. All right, let's lift off this. So my units can get through easily. All right, so we need to push into this location. Come on, kill that stupid guardian. There you go. All right, let's get some mines going. Oh, God. Ow! Oh! oh, there's a burrowed guy there. That explains it. All right, we should be able to replace guys as quickly as we lose them. So let's uh, let's just queue all those up. All right, you guys are coming along as well. Same with you. And you. This is going to be a group effort. Setting up as many siege tanks as I can. If this doesn't work, I'm out of ideas. Alright, so there's that. Oh god, torture core. Well, hey, maybe if he comes this way. Maybe if he comes this way, he'll step on my mines. Alright, it, it is focus time, man. We have our game face on. Goliaths up here. Make sure there's no burrowed units. Yeah, not so tough now, are ya? Okay. We have finally made some forward progress. Unfortunately, we have to go all the way over there, and I don't know how to get over there. Alright, I should probably build some more tanks. And I can go ahead and get this upgrade. Alright, lay some more mines. Yes, kill all the Hydras. Yeah, oh, that killed like all my guys too, but whatever. 
Whatever, I'm not even mad, I don't even care. Go ahead, Tarakon. Cause I got more reinforcements on the way. Oh god, what is that? Seriously, a mutilist? No, I actually need this gas income. Quick, turrets! Build all the turrets! All right, everyone, everyone doing good over here? Killing off everything, having fun? No problem. All right, there we go. Come on, turrets. Come on, turrets. All right, you guys just start long distance mining, who cares? All right, well, lesson learned. Mech is the way to go on this level. So that's, uh, that's good to know. Whoops, killed my own guy. Whoopsies. All right, you guys, you guys just go do that. I think the attack move should be enough. Oh, not another tortured roar. All right, took that out. The more hatcheries we kill, the better. Come on, we can do it. We can do it. Ready to roll out. Ready to roll out. Order served. I got lots of backup coming, guys. Just hang in there. Yes. Eat my spider mines. Yes. Oh my god, he keeps killing them before they hit him, though. So that's unfortunate. Wow. Wow. I think he's going for my expansion, actually. Alright, so we did kill off more and more hatcheries, so that's good. We just gotta keep pushing. Oh my god, are you serious? Uh... Alright, can one Goliath kill one Guardian? Probably not, huh? Oh god, he's back. Alright, should be able to kill him with this. Oh god! No! No! Oh my goodness! This game! Wait, I have a battle cruiser. Alright, you're gonna you're gonna be the official protector of this area. I see more gas. I'm actually getting low on money. This really sucks. Alright, kill that stupid infested Terran. Let's right, position this right here. Okay, that should be good. That should be really good, actually. Alright, did we kill this fool off yet? Alright, I think so. Alright, I actually have to build a command center up here. Alright, let's keep pushing. Let's keep pushing. I think we actually broke this though, so that's good. Alright, we're gonna slowly enter our way up here. Hopefully that's our only Hydra Den. Alright, Siege Tanks, you're in a good spot. Don't screw this up. No! I said don't screw it up! That is the opposite of not screwing it up! Oh my god, so many guys. Maybe if we get some mines up here, maybe that's gonna help. Alright, well... I think this guy's gotta move. He's, he's the main problem. No! Scan! Kill the lurker, what are you doing? Oh god, not tortured roar. No! Alright, we're killing some more buildings, so that's good. Alright, we have any reinforcements down here? Definitely need some more tanks. I kind of misplaced the other ones. Alright, command center is on the way. I am super low on money, though, so we have got to babysit these guys. And that should actually be the majority of their production. Alright, 
right, siege mode. Siege. Alright, we're killing him off. We're doing good. We are doing good. Now, I, I can actually kill this guy from the high ground if I can get over there. Or do I have to do a drop? Oh, I gotta go that way, don't I? Alright, well, we're gonna finish killing off this BS, because, uh, screw it. Alright, these guys are going to come over here. There you go. Kill that. Kill that. And you guys got that, so I can bring these guys down. Alright, everyone, come down here. We got, we got yet another base to destroy. Hopefully. Oh god. Oh god. That's a lot of zerglings. Actually, let me see. How the hell do I get over here? Alright, looks like it's this way. Alright, you guys can- Oh my god, why are there so many zerglings down here? Alright, you're gonna see up there. The rest of you guys go down there. Get some more goliath action going. Alright, we have to try and kill this base with what we got. And that's not a lot. Yep, there you go. There you go, very nice. Take him out, plant mines, that's fine. No! Oh god, that mine was almost devastating. Oh my god, are you guys still working on that hive? You guys come over here. Alright. Be so careful, you guys. I don't care this video is going to be like an- Oh god. Oh, he's going to spawn right on top of this, isn't he? What are you on? Oh, plant the mines. Plant the mines. Here he comes. Here he comes. He's got to kill everything. No! Alright, this siege tank's totally getting out of there. I feel like my mines are doing more damage than good. Alright, time to go. Actually, wait. Maybe I can kill him with this. Oh god. Oh god. Ow. Ow. Yes, Goliaths. Nice. Keep the pain train going. Of course he kills it. Of course he does. We gotta try and kill this base, man. There's no other way about it. All right, you guys keep pushing up here. Oh my god, I'm so low. I actually have to start making workers again, I think. All right, let's now nope, back up, back up, back up. Kill the Hydra. Don't lose the tank. Don't lose the tank. Woo! Alright, you guys have got to come join, because it's not looking good. Here's some more reinforcements. Alright, we took that guy out. You guys are coming down here as well. We're going to have preemptive scan. Alright, alright, not bad. Not bad, we're getting close. Getting very close here. You've got to be so patient on this map. That's all I got to say. All right, I guess I'm going to make more workers because I have, like, none up here now. Make it happen. Make it happen. All right, do we have any idle workers? Just these guys. So I guess you're going to come all the way up here. Channel over. All right, well, I definitely learned air not the way to go. We can, we can remember that for next time. And come on, kill that Guardian. Let's have a siege tank right here. And a siege tank right there. No, they got another one. No. Oh my God, are you serious? Are you freaking serious? I wasn't quick enough. All right, well these guys, you got, you got to do it, guys. It is all up to you. It is time. No, no, anything but that. Not that. How did you even manage to find the one spore crawler over here? Oh god. Oh my god. All right, at least this base is basically defunct at this point. At least I hope so. Alright, where's that stupid guy? Oh, he's over here. Killing everything, of course, up to nine kills. Alright, 
Nope, nope. Don't want to lose that. Oh, uh, but I may have to. No, he's getting away. Uh. All right, well, hopefully this is going to be enough, which I don't think it will be, but whatever. Because I'm pretty sure, right, I have to kill all the, uh, kill Zerg Cerebrate. Oh, I don't think I even have to do this. Oh, my God. Are you serious? I don't even think I have to do this. I think I'm actually just being a big goober right now. All right, we got to bring these guys up here. And medic, medic. I don't even care anymore. How do you keep finding these? How are you so bad? Alright, thankfully this guy's defunct at least. Oh, those aren't though. Well, there goes that battle cruiser. Oh my god. He, oh my god. Well, this is my uh, last effort. Hopefully this works. I, I don't think these guys are gonna. No, nope, they can't do this. They can't actually kill that. So, those guys are screwed. Hopefully this is enough. Otherwise, this is my new base. Alright, so you guys are going up there. You guys actually have an escort, so let's not, uh... Let's not screw... Oh, God. Where? I, I can't even kill that. I have a Goliath. And one siege tank. Alright, we can do this. We can do this in the most painfully slow way we've ever seen. Alright, two out of four. Two out of four. I'm gonna send these two up here just in case. Knowing my luck, they'll die to something. Alright, here we go. Bam! One more, please be enough. Please be enough. Oh, I sure hope so. Please. Come on. Come on, everyone wants to go to bed. Oh, thank God. Oh, thank God. Uh, excuse me, Admiral, but I'd like to introduce someone to you. You're in, you son of a bitch. What's the meaning of this? Admiral de Gaulle, I've heard a lot about you. Who the... What the hell are you? I am Kerrigan. The Zerg you've killed here, and the Overmind which you've come to collect, are mine. As is our mutual friend, Lieutenant Duran. You see, Admiral, there are a number of groups in this sector who feel that your involvement here causes certain complications. My associates and I intend to make sure that your reign is short-lived. You may find that difficult, you abomination. Seeing as how I possess the means to disrupt your control of the Zerg. Ah, you're referring to your vaunted Psy Disruptor. It won't last you forever, Admiral. Sooner or later, I'll destroy it. Then I'll show you what the Zerg are really capable of. Oh, and by the way, Admiral, your friend Stukov was twice the man you are. <laughs> I'm glad you saved me. Duran and Kerrigan. Come on, Valkyries, you can do it! You can do it, Valkyries! Hang in there! Oh my god, that mission. That mission right there took me 53 minutes. But I got the highest score, and that's all that matters. Alright, is there a cutscene? Yes, there is! Zerg! The very mention of this terrifying race once brought fear to all who heard it. But now we can all rest easy as our own forces now occupy their very homeworld of Char. Months have passed since our initial confrontation with the Zerg, and now Directorate forces have taken control of the planet Char, long since rumored to cradle the malevolent overmind of the Zerg. The overmind itself an enormous living brain-like entity dictates control of all the myriad Zerg forces, and it was believed to be planning an invasion of the Earth itself. Once on the offensive, our highly trained directorate forces were more than a match for the beast-like Zerg. Even their fiercest warrior breed could not defeat the greatest military technology in the galaxy. 
The Zerg forces on Char were completely decimated and their losses were tallied in the millions. But all wars have casualties, and while Directorate losses were minimal, the fleet's Vice Admiral Stukov gave his life during the final valiant assault on Char. Memorial services were held aboard the Directorate flagship Alexander. Vice Admiral Stukov truly knew the meaning of sacrifice. Yet his sacrifice was not in vain. The Obermind itself was the prize of the battle. Even now, Directorate psychics and powerful drugs are keeping the creature pacified. The Obermind will undergo extensive research to ensure the continued safety of the United Earth Directorate and of all mankind. Alright, so we finally finished Protoss, we finally finished Terran, which means we are going to be going on to the Zerg. Hope you guys enjoy it! My god, my voice is shot, and I'll see you guys next time!